I'm just trying to decide what volume to have the TV on as well. We'll have to see whether they can hear it through that or mm -hmm. through. I think it might. Be, um, I think it's difficult, isn't it? Hello. I don't know if anyone can see us yet. Yeah. Hi, Hi, people. Uh, fella, papa. Can you guys hear the Kingdom Hearts theme tune in the background? Oh, 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 oh. oh my gosh. Hello. Hello. YouTube saying nobody is watching. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> Hello, yes, 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 yes. People can hear the Kingdom Hearts theme tune, but it's quiet. Okay. Nice. Hi. Welcome to this comfy, sleepy time. Pajama stream. Pajama stream. <laughs> We're in pajamas and blankies. Yeah, we are. And we got a type. Uh, yeah, we got a <laughs> Good boy. We want to have a nice. Ah, sleepy. eight people watching. Oh, eight. Nice. Thanks, you too. We're going to have a nice, just cozy, cozy time. We're on the sofa downstairs. <laughs> yeah. Um, Hi, Stacey. Hello, everyone. Okay. Hello, We're at least eight people. At least eight people, at least. 108, 95, who knows? Hi, Jerry. Hi, Hi Jerry. Alex. Hi, Alex. Hi, people. Right, um, I suppose we should, like, start. Yeah. I don't know, like, should we wait a couple of minutes for people to join? It's true, it's true. Because, like, people, uh, someone on Instagram said that they've never actually seen or played Kingdom Hearts, so it's like... It's just like, oh my god, I'm so happy we get to introduce you to this. Mm -hmm. Oh, so yeah, we're just going to be doing a nice little chill one. If you want to ask questions, feel free. The good boy is very good. He's just had a walk, so he's tired, and hopefully he won't be too much of a bother on tonight's stream, like he has been on the last couple of Twitch streams. Mm -hmm. um, we're playing the very first Kingdom Hearts game tonight. We're playing the 1.5 remix on PS4, but it's the first game um, from way back when. Okay. I think we're, I think we're okay. I think we're okay. Um... If too many people are in the chat, I might have to slow the chat down. But yes, we are incredibly excited for the new Kingdom Hearts, which is why we're doing this, because I've been just like hit with a huge wave of Kingdom Hearts nostalgia. And being someone who's extremely hyper-fixates... Oh, I don't have a new Game Plus. Oh. Huh. I guess we're going from the very beginning. Yes, we're going from the beginning. Yeah, being someone who hyper-fixates, like, I haven't been able to stop thinking about replaying this <laughs> for like, the last two weeks. We only replayed it again like a couple of months ago as well. Yeah. Well, no, it was in the old house, so it was over a year ago. Yeah. We haven't played it here, babe. We did. Because that's where the disc was out. The disc was out because it was in the PS4 when no, we moved. I don't okay, whatever. Doesn't matter. Ah, thank you, Stacey. You're so sweet. And also, we're taking someone's live stream virginity. <laughs> Welcome. Welcome to Next Rising Industries Live. Oh, speaking dog. of huh? Speaking of Next Rising Industries Live, oh. later on we'll talk about a thing. Um talk about but, a fun thing. Yeah, is it can you like hear us properly? Can you hear the TV properly just before we get going? Yeah, I mean I'm I'm pretty weepy listening to this theme song as well. It's just like, Cool. You can hear both. Nice! Quiet. Are we comfy or are we quiet, sorry? Or are we the. like, okay? Or... TV is faint, but don't. Yeah, that's the thing. I don't want it to be too loud. Yeah. Cool. As long as you can hear the TV somewhat. Because obviously we, we are playing it actually on the television quite far away from where the microphone is on the laptop. Then let's hit it. Yeah, it's oh, slightly we... louder. I will. Um, oh! The thing is, the TV is a loud TV anyway. I don't want it to be too loud for my own old person reasons. Yeah, I know, right? Um, sh guys, shall we play this on normal or easy? Because I'd really like to get through the game for everyone. 
And so if we play it on easy, there's a chance we'll get through it and be able to play like another Kingdom Hearts as well. Um, I want to go on beginner. You want to go on beginner? Yeah, easy. People are saying easy. Nice. Let's do it. It's just for the story. The amount of times I've actually played this. Manual. Yeah. Yeah. <gasps> Here we go! <laughs> easy, we all noobs. It's true. It's true. Like, I'm now of that age where I used to play games and be like, I have to play the hard mode because I need to prove I'm a hardcore gamer. And now I'm like, I like stories and I just want to see them. I know. Ah! <laughs> oh, I got big feels. Oh, it's been so many years. Like, it's so nostalgic. I've been having these weird thoughts lately. Is any of this for real? Or not? <laughs> oh, this theme song? I'm just crank it up just for this theme song for people. Because I remember playing this game for the first time and being told just like, just wait, just enjoy this. Mm -hmm. Iconic. Oh. oh. Run to your boyfriend. Run to him. Run to him. He's given me too many things lately. To all I need. <laughs> oh, you know I love you. Someone said careful of copyright. I know, but there's like this stream's gonna be instantly demonetized as it is. Oh, I love it. Nothing's like Whatever lies beyond this morning is a real later on. Regardless of what the future doesn't scare me at all. Nothing's like before. Favourite ship in Kingdom Hearts? I was about to uh, have a little bit of discourse because someone said, have we heard the new song for Kingdom Hearts 3? And low-key, I don't like it. You don't like the Yutana Hikaru one? I don't like it. But, and I've always liked her songs, but it's so not the mood of any of the but trailers. I heard, and I think it's confirmed now, it's getting swapped out for the Skrillex theme song that's been written. Good. And I haven't heard that one yet. No, I haven't heard that one yet. Ah! It just didn't feel like it was part of the... Like... The song felt like none it was from of, a different trailer. None of the trailers seem to have had the best music so far. And I've got too many ships from this game. Like, everything. Everything. Oh, here we go! Oh. <laughs> so much to do. So little time. Take your time. Don't be afraid. The door is still shut. Now step forward. Can like, you do it? No. Can you? Falls over. <laughs> <laughs> like, Sirico is obviously, like, the ship of Kingdom Hearts. Yeah. Like, got a little bit of Sirico. I always go with strength, because it's easy mode. Magic can... Suck my toad. <laughs> <laughs> Give me that power. The power of the warrior. Invincible courage. A sword of terrible destruction. It isn't. <laughs> it isn't. Is this the power you seek? Yeah. <laughs> Would we ever cosplay Kingdom Hearts? Yes! Maybe there's a... Plans. And I cosplayed Riku back in the day. I'd love to redo him. I did his regular outfit, an organisation coat, and also... Uh, 
the school uniform. Why am I stuck? Oh, definitely Sora Riku over Kairi Sora. Like, Kairi's fine. Like, I don't have that thing against Kairi that a lot of people used to always have against her for being, like, the girl. No. But Sora and Riku is, like, end game excellent. Mm, goodbye, magic. Okay, okay not. Uh, we will be at Katsucon in 2019. We and we will. We, we did just book our flights. And we will be having a live panel on the Friday afternoon. So if you're there for that, you can come along and meet us there. I'm sorry, Jerry. I just would rather not be. <laughs> Get wrecked, I guess. One of the biggest like questions we always get is, are you able to come to this convention in this state or this country? And the answer we always give will always remain the same. If that convention invites us, there is more of a chance that we can come to it. Because that's the way to do it. We You've really... gained the power to fight. I don't want this. <laughs> <laughs> Press X to attack. Oh, look how cute it is. I love, I love it so much. Babies. Oh, thank you so much, Isabel. Thank you. But yeah, at the moment, it looks like Catacomb will be our only American convention. Yeah. I mean, obviously this year we said we were only going across the pond once and we did Canada just by chance. So there's always a chance that we'll be able to like pull it out and do one more in the year. Mm -hmm. But the fact that Catacomb is already... This is just the start of the game, yeah. yeah nobody's missed anything particularly yet. This is like the uh, training level. Mm -hmm. it's, it's very pretty, though. It's lovely. Um. I know this, I know this. So, I'm, I, I know lots of people know a lot about Kingdom Hearts, even if they haven't played it. But for those who don't know, it's a collaboration game between Squaresoft, it's like Square Enix. Squaresoft, who, whoa! They were called Squaresoft when they made the first one. Oh my god, they yeah. were! So, Squaresoft, who are now Square Enix, who make all the Final Fantasy games, and Disney. And so you play as, essentially, a Final Fantasy-esque character who goes on an adventure through the Disney worlds. And it's just, like, amazing. It's, it's like the lowdown is as well. If you've ever heard of multiverse theory, of that everything's happening in, at the same time in different universes, this is multiverse theory, but there is a doorway to all of them. Yeah, there's, like, doorways between all the different universes, and you travel through them. And try and save the universe from imploding. I love these so much. Um, people are asking if we'd play until dawn on the channel, and yeah, I mean, I'd like to. I'd like to do that at some point. It's been a long, long time since I played it. Two years. Yeah, because we did it just before we did the Blackwood Files, because Jack came over and we made him choose all the options. Yeah. Yeah. So, year and a half ish. Um, no, no, it is. It is two years. It is two years. Two years now. Wow. So yeah, we would play it until dawn. We might even do it in costume, just for the funsies of it. And thank you. I'm glad you like my hair. I'm pretty fond of my hair right now. Oh, really I realise the stream is kind of potato quality right now, but what can we do? I've had to lower the quality so that we don't lag as much, because if you know anything about our streams, it's that our internet is terrible. Um, we have seen people asking us to play Detroit. We've seen quite a lot of people asking us to play Detroit, which means it could be on the list. Mm -hmm. It's a fun game. We've just played a lot of it recently, so... A lot. Like, a lot. So we need a bit of a break before we pick it up again. Because, you know, when you play the game too much and you're just like, yeah, get through this bit, come on. And, like, apart from this, I'm always a little bit wary to play games that I know really well, because I don't feel like it gives the same experience... Mm -hmm. Which is why I was wary of playing this to begin with, but I want this list to be checked. Give it yeah. to me. Um, yeah, I would love to cosplay Sora. I'd love to cosplay Sora, and I'd love to cosplay Roxas. I just need to Selfies. sort of wait. Um, I have, I have the Keyblade already upstairs, just sitting there and waiting to be used for a cosplay. So. I still have my Waited on Keyblade upstairs as well. I can see a lot of people asking about Coffee. Um, we've announced this loads of times. We finished 
what we have now dubbed season one and we're working on a second season because we had some issues with where we were filming it. We're not allowed to film there anymore. So we've been working on revamping it and restarting it and it will be coming again in the new year. Mm-hmm. So I don't worry say, about like, that. Selfie is being savage right now. <laughs> is friendship such a big deal? I mean, did you really not like the others that much in eight? Or... <laughs> Like, dang, self. Hey, Titus. Titus. What are you so afraid of? (laughs) What are you so afraid of? I like the answer being indecisive because it's a decisive answer. (laughs) (laughs) So it's like a conundrum in itself. These, like, give you stat boosts and stuff, but, like, I'm never really aware and neither have I ever noticed the difference, so. Um, I am not afraid of any of these things, so I guess that one. You know what's scary, Peters? Your shorts. <laughs> oh, waka. Waka. Waka, 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 waka. What do you want out of life? No, this is, this is waka. Waka talks oh. like, hey, what do you want out of life? <laughs> yes, you're right. You're right. He doesn't even talk in an American accent. He's like, where are you from, waka? <laughs> like, it's supposed to be like Jamaican sort of accent? I guess. <laughs> A dog's first bark was like he'd scared himself. <laughs> oh, he's so asleep. Oh, baby boy. Your adventure begins at midday. Keep a steady pace and you'll come through fine. Nice. Sounds good. On, on second thought, lay me to rest. I enjoyed Final Fantasy X. I tried to play through with you the other day. Final mm. Fantasy 10 and 10 2. 10 2 is my favourite out of the two. Because I'm a sucker for cute girls. Uh, we have a we do have a Discord for the channel. It's a Patreon Discord. It's available to everybody from $1 on Patreon. Um, but obviously, because we offer it as a Patreon perk, we can't have another Patreon for everyone. No. Because that wouldn't be fair on the patrons. Um, but obviously, there is a Nixling There Discord is a Nixling fan, fan chat right? that yeah. we don't run as well. If you guys just wanted a community that you guys could talk in. So that's a really sweet community. They're always really friendly to each other. Hello. Hello. Um, for people who've just arrived who are asking how far we are, this is still the tutorial level. We've, we've just started. Mm-hmm. All you've really missed is I told Magic, like, suck a fat one. <laughs> It's the safe point, just so you know. Oh, I love this one. It's so pretty. Hello, people that are just joining. Yeah, the stream's going to be available afterwards, so don't worry about that. It might be a little while afterwards, because I... Oh, I can't block all yet. Wow. Oh. And just run up these beautiful steps. I remember the first time I played this, I was like, oh, oh god, I don't want to fall, I don't want to fall, I don't want to fall. <laughs> As if they didn't put invisible walls. Mm-hmm. In a kid's game. The closer you get to light, the greater your shadow becomes. Big. Here comes the big shadow. Belle didn't deserve to be fought on like this. <laughs> she loves a monster. I mean, you're right. She's a monster lover. Mm. That's, what, that's why the monster comes out on her slab. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I always find it a bit odd that Sora doesn't like make any mouth sounds during this. It's in his... It's Dream, I know, but I I won't shut up in my own dreams sometimes. Uh, someone's asked whether we play Dragon Age on the channel. I think the answer is probably no, because to get anywhere in a Dragon Age game on the channel, we'd have to play it for like forty hours. And seeing as our live streams are only usually a few hours long, we'd be playing it for a year. Again, it's just not. It doesn't feel interesting. I mean, like, I'm a perfectionist when it comes to games, so I enjoy 
taking it easy and just sort of milling around. Hello. How are you doing this, are you? I can hit it back again. Aha! Give me your hand, you coward. Why is your hand your weak spot? <laughs> I kind of go for a nice little ankle. Someone said they really hope you can cosplay Aqua in the future. Mm, I really want to! Aqua is beautiful. I love Aqua so much. No, I really, really enjoyed as what we did play with that game, but I just found like the grinding to be really tedious. On Dragon Age? No, no. Oh, on, um, oh, on um, Birth by Sleep. Yeah. Yeah. Like we did get reasonably far. Also, I think we played as Ventus the first time. Because they give you the option of yeah. all three characters. But you're not supposed to play as him first. Really? I don't think so. Ooh. So I think it's easier if you play Aqua, Ventus, and then Terra. Okay. But like they didn't suggest that. No. We were like, oh, it must be him because he's obviously like mm -hmm. the Sora Roxas character. That'll do me. No, I'd love to cosplay Aqua. I sort of, she's been on my plans list for the longest. As has Axel. Axel's been on my plans list since the second game came out. Because <laughs> I remember the second game coming out and just seeing his hip to waist ratio and being like, dang, I could do that. Nice. She have a corset on. I got them hips and to waist. And you suit them red hair. Yeah, I don't want them red hair. I don't weep for red hair. I don't weep for him. Uh, oh, here we go. Cutscene, lads. It's time for Curry's to call him a lazy bum. Lazy bum. this first came out, I would actually just play the game to hang out on Destiny Island because I felt like I was on holiday. <laughs> Sorry if the game audio sounds weird at all, we're just like, this is our first time streaming with the PS4, um, so we're not sure about settings and stuff yet. Yeah, and unfortunately because I work on Mac because... Well, it's the best editing platform that I can use, mm -hmm. is using MacBook. It's not great for games, yeah. and so I've got like a game capture encoder, and it doesn't work properly with the Mac, and... Oh, oh, oh God. It's Riku. Oh, Riku. Oh. I love him. I love him so much. <laughs> Riku's come to call everybody out. <laughs> Oh no, oh my god guys, I just want to apologise in advance because the Riku minigame that you can replay until you beat him, I will replay it until I beat him. Last time we did this you did that five times and then you gave up because you didn't beat him. I will do it. I need to kick his ass. <laughs> Someone's asked where are their parents? Okay. So this is like never explained really in the first game properly. There's one cutscene like where you hear Sora's mum, but they don't live on this tiny island. Like this is just an island near the island they live at that all the kids like take a little boat out to and play on. It's really cute. Yeah. I mean it's like dream life as a child. Hello. Oh god, where I need to get I need to get three coconuts, some Two logs, one cloth, one rope. Oh, not coconuts. I think me and B would do Sora and Riku or Axe and Roxas. Mm -hmm. For everyone saying this one or this one or this one. Like I like I say I really want to reprise my Riku cosplay. What's happening, man? <laughs> <laughs> what is your voice? Help! 
Like, her voice sounds exactly how I would have expected Selfie's mm-hmm. voice. Waka's voice scares me. Oh, oh, thank you. Oh, my gosh. Thank you. Someone's said there's a super chance to beat Riku. Oh, no. Now I have to. Um, thank you, Squawking. And thank you, Anime Love and Nicole. Um, would we play Life is Strange as Chloe and Max? That might be fun. Yeah. Yeah, we'd consider it. Speaking of, we've just downloaded and played Life is Strange 2 the other day, and I cried. Like, Yeah, we played episode oh, one, and we just like, my God. weeping. Openly weeping. Um, like, I think I cried three times, mm-hmm. and I did not cry that much in Life is Strange 1. No, not at all. Life is Strange 1 wasn't a teary scenario. Life is Strange 2 has just had us in tears. Mm-hmm. And I'm weak for like big family situations anyway. Um, any plans to cosplay King Heart at Katsukon? Yes, entirely. If you don't follow my Instagram and Twitter, I've been tweeting about pretty much nothing but that for the last two or three weeks. Um, and I've got plans. But they're secrets. Okay. They involve you, but they're secrets. Oh. <laughs> okay. I will probably just do my what I'm told. <laughs> yeah, you will. Mm. That's the way it works. Swim, swim, swim. What? What am I looking for? Ah! Forgot about that bit. Do, do, do. Oh yeah, because you're collecting like s- supplies. Like, I guess. Did you speak to Kyrie and ask her? Yeah, I picked up a log already, and ah, that's the other log. I got the cloth, the rope, and one log. Two logs. Um. Oh, apparently you kept passing the mushrooms by. No time now, you useful bum. <laughs> mushrooms, mushrooms, mushrooms. It must be a better kind of I always forget what they get. Oh no, wait, they are in the secret place, aren't they? There's mushrooms in the secret place. <laughs> um, any cosplay plans in the works that you can share? I think we can share Les Mis plans. Yay, Miz. Yay, Miz. Um, yeah, we, we're not going to tell you exactly what it's for, but me, B, and Jack are doing a Les Miserables cosplay thing very soon. And um, possibly what, something... The mushroom? mushroom. I don't think you're at collecting the mushrooms yet. These are the first supplies you need. God dang. So I know at one point you need eggs, so... Yeah, but that's on the other half of the island. Go and speak to Kyrie again and see what you need. You're not concentrating. Um, yeah. Yeah, I've lost my train of thought now. Les Mis. Um, yeah, Les Mis and also possibly a Greek mythology thing. So those are two current plans. Um, and seeing as we're into the stream now, I can say that our panel at Katsukon is going to be... The Dark Lord Wears Prada, live. Wait. Okay, cutscene. Plot. This made me think that he lives on the island as well. It's because at this point they don't really explain that she's from like a different planet. I was a very young teenager when this first came out. I really hated Kyrie. Now I'm older, I'm like, she's adorable and I will protect her. Mm-hmm. I really appreciate Riku thinking they can get to other worlds on a wooden raft when it takes a spaceship in the game. Multiverse theory. Oh, Riku, you're so good. He just. Riku really reminds me of Cypher. The whole, he's got his heart in the right place, mm-hmm. he's thinking the big dreams, and he just gets manipulated. Mm-hmm. Like, he's such a Cypher character, and I love them both.
You shared it now. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah, but you two have already shared it by doing this. Look at that waist. Who are you doing your waist training with? <laughs> <laughs> Sergeant Strawberry just pointed out they take boats to this island, but they need to build a wooden raft to find other worlds. Logic. <laughs> M O U S E Mickey Mouse. Mickey Mouse. <laughs> oh my god, it's time for my favourite bit with the <laughs> God, I love how extra this palace is. Mm -hmm. Mickey, you extra bitch. <laughs> Look, extra bitch. I love him. Mickey Mouse, you are so small. I appreciate his statue of, like, Donald and Goofy. Does he usually just hang out there, like? <laughs> nice. This is my big throne. In my big throne. I like to be small. <laughs> My favorite bit. <laughs> yes, Mickey is the king of. I Disney mean, like. World? Oh, I can't remember what their planet's called. He's the he's, yeah. Is he's the king of this kingdom, whatever this is. But, like, is appreciated as a king across all of the universes? Sort of. Yeah, he is, isn't he? So he's like the king of the universe? Listen, if you ever wanted to hear Mickey Mouse saying, Oh, you can lock the door in the darkness! <laughs> or, like, Mickey Mouse straight up killing, selling you to kill a man. This You're in the, the right game. game. For you. It's so campy, I love it. <laughs> oh, oh, big feels. Yeah, it is, I think it is just called Disney Castle. I think you're right, Becca. Hello. Everyone's talking about the Palpoo fruit now, huh? I'd like to get a little palfrey fruit tattoo. That'd be cute. A tiny one. That'd be cute. And then you could too. Yeah. And then we share a palfrey. Oh. Cute. Who'd you, share, who'd you share it with? Kyrie? Would you share it with Kyrie? Because your girlfriends. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Waka, what vaguely racist accent do you have for me today? <laughs> Oh, are you? They're boyfriends. <laughs> yeah? Oh, wacker. You're so vaguely racist. I want this egg. Can I pick up the egg yet? No, you have to go and- Oh no, you can! Cool. Yeah. I remember being able to pick things up and then just go to Harry and she's like, Hey, have you been- Oh, you got it. <laughs> wow. I can kick your ass. <laughs> Savage, Tidus. Tidus. Wow. I guess. I'm gonna kick your ass. I've just realised that we are like- Huh? Our faces are like totally- Oh. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, so what? I'm totally over the health health thing. Let me put us up in that corner. We're moving. It's realistic. Alright, so I've got the egg. Now I can go grab that mushroom. 
Okay, to Night Fury and anyone else still wondering, this is a crossover between the creators of Final Fantasy and Disney. Um, it's got a bunch of the characters from the various Final Fantasy games in it, as like kids or adults or teenagers. It's got these three original main characters, Sora, Riku, and Kairi, and then it's got a whole bunch of Disney characters in a whole bunch of different places. Like, we're going to go to Tarzan, we're going to go to the Hercules world, like, I learned past dun 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 I'm so triggered. <laughs> Get up on the hydra's back. 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 Break the barrels. <laughs> Can we say privet? As in like privet drive? Privet. Privet. I think we can. In a nutshell, Dark Disney. I like that. I like that a lot. I think that's Polish or Romanian. I'm really sorry, we can't read that. Here he is, ominous. He looks like Obi Wan Kenobi. That's what I always thought. I always just thought he kind of looked like a sack, a potato sack, to like make it fashion. Well, he's got like the warrior chest strap, like Mad Max style. You say warrior, I say gimp suit. He does look like a sand creature from Star Wars. Yeah. Oh yeah? I'm 12. Who are you, stranger? Oh, Privet is high in Russian. Privet. Privet. What's your favourite and least favourite world to play in Kingdom them. Hearts 1 and 2? Least favourite is probably... Uh, I don't remember what worlds there are now in Kingdom Hearts 1. So my least favourite was in the first one was always the Winnie the Pooh world, just because it felt uh, really extra. Yeah. But like as I've grown older, I've appreciated no, it I more. I really like them. They're just a the little fun extra um, thing. Uh, my favourite one was always Ariel. Like the Little Mermaid, but that's because I'm a sucker for swimming, and a sucker for any games that are like underwater where you can do that. And not in miss. Kingdom Hearts two, I wasn't mad about the Lion King world where you play as a lion, yeah. because it's just like slightly frustrating mechanics. But um, Nightmare Before Christmas world in yes. both games is my favorite one. It's very good. It's very good. Penguin's asleep on the floor over there. He yeah, had a very big walk. I think Kingdom Hearts 2 is still my favourite game. Oh, Alice's World, yes. Alice in Wonderland is actually the worst one. Oh, because it's you, very bad. It's always like, oh, can I remember, to, like, do I have to get bigger? Do I have to get smaller? I can't find a way. Yeah, that was always frustrating. I win. What would you call it? Ishkiri, um, bro. These nuts. <laughs> Be my boy. <laughs> Name the rough. Be my boy. Be my boy. <laughs> what do you want to call it? Be my boy. I'd call it Be my boy. Or, I mean, that's a decent enough name, but. Be my boy. What should we call it? <laughs> Riku, be my boy. <laughs> do, do, do. No, you're not calling it Be My Boy. Oh my god, do you really want me to call it? Yes! It's gotta be Be My Boy, and you've gotta win now. And then you'll know if ever there's a piece of wood floating around in the ocean just called Be My Boy. Be My Boy. Ah, you may really question it. Be my boy. Be my boy. Be my boy. Trademark be my boy. <laughs> Should I be like be my boyfriend? Is that that? Yeah, sure. Be my boyfriend. <laughs> hey, Riku, be my boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> oh 
Oh, me? Be my boyfriend. Be my boyfriend. And yes, it is possible to win because I did it. Yeah, it is possible. You just have to be really skilled at this bit of the game. Okay. So. Mm. I will do it. Savage, Riku. I don't think you're edging away from me. I'm giving you room to move your elbows. Okay, so this is what I've always found is that Riku takes the extra way. But if you're really fast and you just go up this way, then you can just sort of... It's just getting back that's hard? Ooh. This is where he's gonna oh, beat you. He's gonna beat me because he's taking me upstairs. Group. Dang. This is where he's gonna beat you. No! Oh, 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 oh! <laughs> yeah, you, you walk. Be confident. Oh my god, you got it, you got it, you got it, you got it, you got it. Be my boyfriend! <laughs> yeah! Yes! Yes! <laughs> he did it! <laughs> Yay! So yeah, that's the trick, is that you need to, as soon as he goes forward at the beginning of the race, take a right. Hard right. Man, lighten up! It's just a name. Mm -hmm. Be my boyfriend. It's not just a name. Be my boyfriend. <laughs> Yay, you I did, did it! it. <laughs> it's the only time I've ever seen you do it. <laughs> I'm so happy. I knew I could. Belve in yourself. There's another mushroom. And I think the third mushroom I saw it a minute ago. It's in the little... It's down here. Yeah. Oh, I'm so happy. Get wrecked, Riku. Okay, so... Where is Kyrie? Oh, Squawking sent you another super chat to say oh, you did yeah, it! Yeah. Thank you, Squawking! You were propelled on by their super chat I was. saying, beat Riku. Beat Riku. Oh, god dang. So much more to do. I need to get... Three fish. Three fish. Bottle of water. Oh, the fish are here, aren't they? Um, no, they're by the pier where... Selfie is? Selfie's at, yeah. Um, water, obviously, by the waterfall. And then coconuts. Coconuts. Oh, give me some coconuts. Here we go. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Get wrecked, Riku. Love you. Okay, so. Like, do you, is it you hit the trees to get them? Can't quite remember. What well, the coconuts? Mm -hmm. Get the drinking water first. Oh yeah. Now I'm just gonna get the fishies. And you've got the mushroom in the secret place yet? I've got all of oh, them. Oh, cool. Um, fishies by the dock, and then you have to go back to where Kyrie is and hit those trees for coconuts, I think. Mm. But it has to be the green ones, for some reason. Even the Ah, the background. Whoa! I love that Sora can straight up grab fish out of the water with his hands. I mean, like, Noctis is quaking. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. It has to be in standing water. Oh, oh, wow. Ah! Cool, we got the fishies. <laughs> Best ship name ever, literally, be my boyfriend. Be my boyfriend. Hey, waka, 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 waka. Violet Moon Dust says Sora is a bear in disguise, and I don't know whether they mean like. like a bear. I'm a bear, like... I'm a bear, you wish you were a bear. <laughs> but Sora is most certainly oh, not a. You've got to have a green one. It's got to be green. Coconut. You just gotta keep hitting it till the green coconut's full. Coconut! Going. coconut. <laughs> Give to me! Coconut. Uh. <laughs> ah. I hope this is riveting for everyone. <laughs> ah, yeah, one! Ah, ah! Now you need two more. Uh, it probably has to be different trees, but. Uh. Hello, I'm gonna invade this island. Uh, the game sound isn't off. We've just had to crank it down quite low. Put it up a little bit. 
Mainly because I'm an old person. So I'm always like, what? It's too loud! The thing is, it's like super loud in the living room where we are, but the microphone is facing away from it, so it's probably quieter for you guys. Yeah, so um, we're using the microphone in the webcam at the moment, but we're going to get a USB splitter so that we can use the super powerful microphone. Is there no set? Is there no like, oh, thingy on your laptop for the sound to come out, that the game sound to come through? No, okay. because I'm having to Green. stream the window and not mm. actually through the encoder because Macs are broken. One day we'll be able to afford getting a proper gaming computer. Today is not that day. No. So we really want to get a gaming PC at some point, but that is expensive, isn't it? Ooh, what's happening? We're having a wiggle again. I'm sorry, it's disrespecting those trees right there. So I was reading this chat and I just started running into a wall. <laughs> I'm good at games. Threatening. Be my boyfriend. Be my boyfriend. <laughs> Hello, I have things. In the old days, sailors always wore to hell at Asala. So we're supposed to enjoy, enjoy a safe voyage. See this? It's a charm to help us find each other if we ever get separated. The three of us will be together always. Cute. I have the things for you. Thanks, Aura. I found something today here. It's yours. Terry just like digging up a high potion on the beach, like, oh, I don't think this is important. Tomorrow is a big day. Why is it a big day? Because the world's ending. Yeah. Oh, what's so pretty. Yeah. I always thought this conversation was savage. Mm. Carrie's like, let's run away just the two of us. But no, he's my best friend. Favourite character in this game? Mm. In this one? Still Riku. Yeah. Like, I like really like his character, I really like his storyline and his arc. I like, I love him. And I love Riku and Zora. Mm. Whereas my favourite character in 2 is probably Axel because I just... Axel and I'm Riku again. I just I stand on both. Riku was born ripped! Riku bench pressed his mum in the womb. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the PO box is always open! I have beaten Sephiroth, oh my god. The PO box it's is pain. always open and the address for it is in the description of this live stream, so you can find it straight away. Donald. Donald! Sorry to rush up without saying goodbye, but there's big trouble brewing! <laughs> Not sure why, but the stars have been blinking out one by one, and that means disaster can't be far behind. I hate to leave you all, but I've got to go check into it. What? I really don't like okay. it. <laughs> <laughs> what, my Mickey Mouse voice? No. There's someone with a key, the key to our survival. So I need you and Goofy to find him and stick with him. Got it? Got it memorized? We need that key or we're doomed. Go to Trevor's town and find Leon. He'll point you in the right direction. Why does King Mickey know school? Leon? <laughs> it's, it's Leon. Thanks, pal. Uh, yeah, we will be uploading this, or releasing this once it's, the stream's over because it's just on the channel now. Just have to trust in the king. I'm so sorry. You didn't know I could do Disney voices to you. <laughs> what? What? Nothing. I love you. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. King Mickey in these games is like one of my favourite characters from anything ever. I love Mickey Mouse, and particularly in Kingdom Hearts. Open up the door, Uh huh. Uh -huh. So I was like, oops. Jiminy Cricket. Favourite Disney film and why? Presently Moana. Yeah, I was about to say Moana. Like, I love all of the old ones, but Moana is just so good. Yeah. It's just got everything I like. It's got all those beautiful subversive tropes. Mm -hmm. It's got a beautiful aesthetic. Amazing acting, amazing songs. 
grandmother feels. If you've sent stuff to the peer box and it's not been in the video yet, it's probably because we haven't heard from the peer box. So I will chase them up this week. So they're supposed to message us every time we get something, and they never do. Favourite Disney character ever? Mm. Like, after re-watching Hercules, I think Megara is still way, way up there as one of my favourites. Because not only is she sassy, independent, knows her own mind, she literally sacrifices herself. Mm. Like, she throws herself in harm's way. And, like, literally dies. L literally literally dies. dies. And, like, I love her so much. Megara is amazing. Um, when I was a kid, Chip and Dale were my favourite Disney characters. That's valid. Me and my brother used to watch them, like, every Saturday. Chip, 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 Chip Dale, Dale. Rescue Rangers. Rangers. Did you ever watch the um, really weird one where Blue is a pilot? Nope. Oh, Tailspin, I think it was called. I think you showed me before. It was really good. It was like all the bear characters, or like the Jungle Book characters, but they were all like pilots. It was very good. Um, current favourite Disney character? I don't know, I love them all. I'm such a huge Disney fan. Mm -hmm. Um... Um, favorite Kingdom Heart world. Yours, you said was Little Mermaid. I think it's a Little Mermaid, and mine is definitely Nightmare for Christmas. But world. I love Nightmare for Christmas. I love like the aesthetic of it. But I'm so weak to games where I get to swim. That's um, why I love Assassin's Creed Black Flag so much. Favorite Heartless. I'm really fond of just the little squiggly shadows. The sandy guys. Yeah. I always wanted a plushy one. Ooh, Peter Pan's a bad world. I don't like the Peter Pan world that much. Mm -mm. I like flying, but I don't like how... But you only get that right at the end. Is. Yeah. Look, that's the island you go to. Yeah, so, so this is... live there. This is Sora's house that he's now leaving. I like that he's got all those regular clothes on the floor. Mm-hmm. And also all of these cardboard robots. I appreciate that his mum is exactly like every other mum of she gave him 0 0.3 seconds to reply and it was like, Sora, why aren't you answering? It's like, you, you just spoke to me. Like, you've only just shouted. I don't, I think, I don't think we'll ever see Sora's mum in a Kingdom Hearts game because it's not about that, you know? Um, Treasure Planet is a underrated game. I love it underrated so much. Film, film, I love it so much. Oh yeah, I can't kill anything yet. No, I? just run. Forgot about that. Um, to the secret place. No, to yeah. Riku first. Oh yeah, he's over there, isn't he? Yeah. Emo. Yeah, it can't do things in the wrong order. The game will not let you. Dang. I did know Roxas's room in the second one is almost identical to Sora's. Yeah. I think they pretty much used the same game map. And why just not? coloured it differently. It's nice. Oh, Atlantis, Jerry, is a very good Disney film. <laughs> and Milo from Atlantis has got to be one of my favourite Disney characters. Milo Thatch. Amelia from Atlantis. Sorry. No, not Amelia from Treasure Planet is one of my favourite characters. Mm. That the captain from Treasure Planet is very good. Least favourite Disney, and what is there any that we think are overrated? I'm not afraid of the Um, I'm really not a fan of Snow White, but I think it's just really dated, you know? I never like Snow White that much because I really don't like her singing. I don't think I've watched Sleeping Beauty since I was a child. Again, another one I, I wasn't keen on as a kid. But um, again, because the, the singing is so dated, it's like of its time. Like, the, like Snow White is like, I know you, I walk with you once upon a dream. <laughs> Even though that's, that's Sleeping Beauty, I just sang. But it's that warbly, yeah. like, nah, nah. it's like, no, thank you. 
that isn't the one. Um, and also it's just kind of suspect. Like, the whole setup of uh, both Sleeping Beauty and Snow White is kind of suspect. It's like, oh, a woman falls unconscious. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's kind of suspect. Although Maleficent is still one of the greatest villains of all time. If not the greatest. Because uh, what's your, what's your uh, motivation here? I'm petty. It's <laughs> <that> nice. <laughs> I love Maleficent. Just also because King Hearts made me love Maleficent so much. Um, I love the Little Mermaid. I might level up a bit actually. Yeah, because you didn't fight anyone on the island, so you haven't leveled up at all. <laughs> um. So someone said Frozen is overrated. It is a little bit overrated, but I still really loved it. But I really enjoy Frozen, and like. I've watched it lots of times. I enjoy it being like a sister sibling sort of story and yeah. not, not really about romance. And I think I started enjoying it even more when I read the theory about how the trolls, oh, the trolls, are, trolls are the guys. real villains. Because the trolls changed like, to Hans's like, um, perspective. Because like, in the troll villain. song, they're like, oh, we'll get your fiance out the way. And then after that, Hans turns evil. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And it's like, I prefer that if it had been the plot. And so that makes me enjoy the story more. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm going to turn down this just a little bit. Um, yeah, because I'm just grinding it. Yeah. So, did we like the Maleficent movie? I love that live action movie. It's going to be my favourite Disney live action that I've seen. <laughs> um, would you ever cosplay a Disney princess? We have, in fact. Last year we did Anna and Elsa from Frozen. There's a video of it on the channel. I forgot about that and I was about to ask you who. <laughs> yeah. I did a makeup test for Merida once. And, and also Ariel. Yeah, I know. And we might be doing, like, Wreck-It Ralph casual Disney princesses at Catacon for an evening. Although that's mainly just going to be for us sitting in a bedroom having a chill time. Yeah. Like, Jenna and Courtney. Having a slum party. Yeah. Ah. I love Little Mermaid. Um, I love it a lot. I think it's one of, like, a really good film. And... I know people think that Little Mermaid is suspect too, because they're like, oh, she's only 16, and she should be listening to her dad. It's like, actually, I think that Little Mermaid's got a good point, because she's basically saying, hey, I don't like the fact that um, my dad is trying to tell me what to think and how to think. Mm -hmm. And he's basically saying, yeah, you should have a free life. Not that way. So I really like the way that's handled. But then, like, when I was, yeah, when I was 16, I wanted more freedom than that and I was a relative adult ish but like people are like oh she's a brat she's not listening to her dad and he wants the best for her and it's like no no he's being racist like he literally says all humans are bad and I will not change my mind about it it's like oh hmm. she's just trying to be you know Becca cool Boop says you'd make an amazing Megara thank you I would love to cosplay her Favourite Pixar movie? Mm. Monsters, Inc. What else have they done? Toy Story, Monsters, Inc. Bring me, bring me a list. Disney Pixar movies. I'm busy grinding so I can't think at the moment. Coco? Oh, Coco, Coco. was incredible. Coco! Although I did love Inside Out as well. Uh, Coco Up, The Incredibles, Toy Story, Brave. Have I showed you up yet? No, I still haven't seen that. Okay, we'll watch that soon. Finding Dory, Finding Nemo. Um. Yeah, I think actually, I think um, Coco and um, Inside Out are like my favourites because Inside Out is a really good representation of how like, emotions can feel. And I think that's important for kids. Yeah. That you shouldn't try and quiet up emotions, you should listen to them. Oh, I just want to fight things. Bad camera, OP. Toy Story is very good as well. Um, weirdly, I was expecting to cry at the end of Toy Story 3 because everyone told me I would. They're and then making I didn't. a fourth. Yeah, I found that really weird. Like, does it, it really doesn't need a fourth now. No. Okay, I've leveled up twice. I think I can carry on. Yeah, so everyone said that I'd cry at the end of Toy Story 3 and then I didn't. And I was like, 
I get why it's emotional, but I don't feel it. And then Coco, I literally like got down on the floor and cried for like 40 minutes, looking through my granddad's stuff. It's very good. We're sucker for grandparent stories, <laughs> if you haven't figured by now. Do, 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 do. Okay, okay, let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's get this let's, done. Let's get this done. Right, t time for big cutscenes. Time for plot. It's the plot. I don't feel so good, Sora. I don't feel so blah. Yay! I'm still thinking about the what's your favourite. Oh, I know what my favourite Heartless is. Does it count as a Heartless? Which one? Technically, I don't think it does count as a Heartless, even though I guess it is. My favourite boss fight of Kingdom Hearts 1 will always be um, the... Oh, what's it called? God dang. I should have saved. It'll be fine. This is an easy fight. Oh, what am I thinking of? The Fantasia battle against um, Night on Board Mountain Demon. Like, it's one of the boss fights right near the oh, end of the game. Oh my god, yeah. And you have to fly around them. It's just because... Night on Board Mountain is one of my favourite pieces of classical music anyway. But then having it as a boss battle was like, oh, I love this bit! Like, it was my favourite bit in Fantasia, and it was my favourite boss battle, and I was just like, oh, this is so satisfying. <laughs> Someone said Kingdom Hearts out here beating Infinity War to the dust punchline. <laughs> <laughs> Carries dust. Look at your carry now, back to my carry now, back to your carry. This carry is now dust. Hello. Um, someone's asked any anime we'd ever cosplay other than Euro and Ice. Oh Christ, he's dead already. Yeah, see, I told you you need to say. Um, or in High School Post Club. Or in High School Post Club. Which we're planning on doing next year. Mm -hmm. And we did years ago, but let's not talk let's about that. Let's never talk about that. <laughs> um, the Castlevania anime. Um, I mean, back in the day there were anime cosplays, but also let's never talk about them. Um, like the thing is people ask this question I'm always like there's lots of animes I love and there's lots of animes I really want to cosplay from but when I'm asked the question I'm always like what's I an don't, anime? I don't want I don't know any animes I've never heard of an anime <laughs> Traverse Town this is one of my favourite worlds in Kingdom Hearts I just really like yeah, it sure. I really like it like, one of my favourite animes of all time is Cowboy Bebop and I would like to cosplay from that maybe at some point that would be fun Not. Yeah, you big palooka. It's so cute. I always remember getting really frustrated with this part of the game when I first played it, so it's like, just keep missing me. Come back. Uh, someone asked, will we ever cosplay from Left 4 Dead again? This was something that we oh. intended on doing in October. In fact, the costumes are just sat there ready, but we ran out of time because of the whole Halloween being busy and stuff. So... Yes, Left 4 Dead is just sat there waiting to go. So whenever we have time... Left 4 Dead! The Trevor's Town is just like... Trevor's Town is just like a nice place. If mm -hmm. I could live in Kingdom Hearts, it would be here or... Hollow Bastion when it's all like fixed up. Yeah, Radiant Garden. But don't call it that. But don't call it that. Because Hollow Bastion is such a better name. Mm -hmm. Do we cosplay anything horror? Obviously, there was Until Dawn because we did the whole Blackwood Files series. Also, um, can I just one, one one moment? I like this guy that's just decided you're not allowed to come up here. <laughs> he's just standing there. He's like, I will move when you've got to the right part of the level. Um, Mom. no, we haven't actually played Dream Drop Distance to the person asking that. Um, that's one of the few Kingdom Hearts games we haven't touched at all yet. Mm -hmm. But 
I know that it's one of the ones you need to have played before three. So we're gonna read a yeah. Mogo. Oh, there you go. Mm, that's Seeing all of this town will take some time, Cooper, especially for newcomers. Even if you can't go to certain areas now, you'll be able to go later. Thanks, Cooper. Cooper, Cooper. Will I elaborate on the Les Miserables cosplays? Um, no, but you'll know soon enough, as in, like, by next week, you'll know more, so... I really enjoyed this recolored Tevis. <laughs> I got separated from my mum and dad when I came here. Mm. Also, she looks like she's come straight out of Final Fantasy IX game. Oh my god. Where am I from? None of your business. Me. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's got an unhappy past. Oh, I need the Zyga to turn do you, re- do you plan on redoing how from how to past? Yes, I would love to! I want to do Sophie. Yeah, you'd be such a good Sophie. I would love to redo how. Like, oh, he was such a dream cosplay. He was my very first cosplay, and I would just, oh, I'd love to redo it because I, I started it. Sid, my boy, I, I did him when I was like in that stage of my life where, hey, if I don't wear makeup, I oh, am a man. it's only a kid. I'm not a kid. The name's Sora. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Oh, dress Tyker as Calcifer. <laughs> God, he's just as, like, um, much of a handful. Mm-hmm. I love him. If you're ever in trouble, come to me. Oh, God, Sid, you just adopted me. I'm so happy. I love him so much. One of the best ships ever. Vincent! Vincent. Valenwind. Oh, my God, Valenwind. But, yeah, we've got... Lots of plans and lots of things that we're planning on doing, cosplay wise. Well, it's very good. It's going to be like Square Enix cosplay year, though. Oh, yeah. Like, we were talking about this the other day because we were talking about Final Fantasy Seven, Seven. And it's kind of like, if someone asked, like, oh, who would you like to cosplay in Final Fantasy Seven? The answer would just be yes. Yep. I, Final I Fantasy sure Seven. Do. Who do you want to cosplay from it? Mm-hmm. Yep. Yep, that's true. I would love to cosplay a Final Fantasy. Because I just love all of them so much. Like, I would love to cosplay. I did Reno a couple of years ago. I did Cloud a couple of years ago. I would love to redo them. Um, Zap, Sephiroth. Yes, all of them, please. On me. I, I could spend the rest of my life just doing Final Fantasy VII cosplays. Mm-hmm. But then also I want to cosplay from Final Fantasy VIII. I'd like... And 9. And, and 10. Nine. And 12. And, uh... 15. Mm-hmm. Like, even, again, we were playing Final Fantasy 15 the other day, and it was like, who do you want to cosplay for this? Yes. Yeah, I would like to cosplay all of them. I want to give them all a go. It's very good. Ironically, there aren't actually that many belts on the Final Fantasy characters. Like, it's one of the big jokes, but... Like, it's kind of, just, it's just Squall. It's just, his well, it's Lulu belts. as well. Oh, yeah. Lulu with a belt dress. Like, every time she's killed a man, she's taken his belt. Which I respect. Um, we haven't played Delta Rune yet, so no spoilers, please, because we do plan on playing it at some point. Um, and yeah, there will be some special Christmas videos coming before Christmas. Uh, B and I are spending... It's a certain birthday. It's a certain character's birthday on Christmas Day. It is. Which means we have to do some look for that. Um, B and I are spending Christmas together at my mum's place. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm very excited about I'm very excited because your family are actually coming up to meet my family in Ellsmere Port, and it's like, yay! It's gonna happen. Like, it's gonna happen. We've only been together for like three and a half years. <laughs> <laughs> Would we ever cosplay Moomins? Okay. I mean, to be fair, as a child, I had a crush on like that redhead scarecrow guy from the Moomins. Oh god, it's always been redheads. Even as a child. But... No? Especially not a moon in itself. I love that there's a question mark there. Oh, they just keep missing me. I remember, like, running out of the, um, house when I first saw that. Oh, that's so sad. Oh! Like, I did, I'm not... I'm not typically an absolute completionist, 
but I did not finish this game until I found every single one of their puppies. Oh. Because puppies and I'm weak. They're in silly places. Time to collect doggos. It is. Dogs. Well, now I've got to ask that question, but it's a silly, silly question. I was about to say, do dogs need a house that big? Yes. Yes, they do. Yes. I did say it was a silly question, that's why yeah. I didn't actually ask it. Silly. Oh, goodness me, I love this game. Come on, get out the floor. Honestly, though, heartless, like sinking into the floor, me escaping social situations. <laughs> Seems. Mm -hmm. No. I don't want to talk. Oh, you'd cross by Ariel from The Little Mermaid, wouldn't you? Yeah. Yeah. I didn't make a press for her. And, um, because it's one of the cosplays that my mum has actually agreed to join me on. Because my mum has always said that she would do Ursula for me. Hmm. Ooh! <laughs> I hate this so much! <clears throat> Why is it? <clears throat> Angry Yoda noise. <clears throat> Hi, Connor! Connor! Connor has slid in with Hi. his Kingdom Hearts. I did see you screaming on Twitter earlier when we said we were going to play this. That makes me happy. I miss you, Connor. I love this random weird factory. It's the for the clock tower, isn't it? Yeah, it's just like the smiley faces and just random handles. and. I appreciate it. I love it. It's extra. I'm just going to grind through it. Do I think, like, if there's any other cosplays we've talked about recently? Um, I think it's just because we've been on such a Final Fantasy and, like, Square Enix binge. Yeah, obviously we've talked about doing modern laundering stuff, mm -hmm. um, but that's kind of just a, a skit idea and not a cosplay for cosplay's sake. Um, well, I mean... We say that, but we know if we did, like, when we do seven, we'll actually make the skit because we're weak. Yeah, but I mean, those are also cosplays for, because we want to do the costume. Yeah. Like, God, I love this farming room. Do you want to farm some levels? Here is an ending heartless. Nice, nice, nice. Hi. What's that? Hi. Yay. You just answer questions. Yeah. Just some that it's like easier to do like this. Okay. Valid. I just like, okay, so if I could own a factory, I would definitely make dials and stuff to look like faces. Because I see faces in everything anyway. <laughs> like the amount of times we're just in the car and I'm like, oh, that house looks like it's got a face. Oh, those tail lights look like a smiley face. Oh, that's my dad's tail light looks like it's frowning at me. Like, I see faces. Oh, everywhere. yeah, whenever we drive in the dark, you're always telling me what kind of faces the cars in front of us have, and it's so cute. <laughs> Sorry, I'm like right on you here. Yeah, you really are. Sorry. It's okay. I didn't think you were, and then I looked up and was like, ooh! Um, on, hi. It's okay. Well, someone had a dream last night that. They were making videos under Nick's writing at a proper production company, like That's I talked about. Dream. Yeah, like it, like I was talking about in my creator video. That's so sweet. Yeah, that's like a big dream from true, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Like Just to companies. elevate other people. It would be very good. It would. Oh dang, I'm rich as heck right now. Oh, you've done nothing but get money. Money. It's spelled M U N N Y. Money. It's so cute. Okay. Ooh, fun. I was about to go in that room, but I know there's nothing in there at the moment, so no one's camping out there yet. Mm -hmm. There's no point. Is it possibly? No, I think there's just a locked chest and yeah. you can't unlock it yet, can you? No. Vacant house. Hmm. How much are we excited for Kingdom Hearts 3, Connor <laughs> asked? <laughs> What's a Kingdom Hearts precious? <laughs> I have done nothing but talk about Kingdom Hearts and Final Fantasy and then Kingdom Hearts again. Like, we've literally just been, like, talking about it constantly, playing it. We watched Advent Children Complete the other day, we're playing Kingdom Hearts now. Like, we're such a screen it's kick. Because it's the best games ever! Bitch. 
this. Maybe not wait for this. Oh, this isn't a boring stream for people, because I'm just, I'm literally just playing the game how I would normally play it. And we aren't even far yet. Yeah, I hope everyone's having a good time, because we have a good chill time. Like I said, this is just like a cosy sleepy time. So we've got a blanket, we've got pyjamas, we've got Kingdom Hearts. It's great. Right, that door won't open yet, because I'd be... Electricity is on? Nope. Yeah. Shame you haven't got something key shaped. Like you now have to go back mm. to the main area. Yeah. I just got excited thinking that Goofy was going to be there, but not yet. Oh god, that's not for ages. It's not for ages. It's not until you've at least done Tarzan. Oh jeez, really? Well yeah, because... You're going to meet Leon, and then you're going to meet Donald and Goofy. And then by the time you meet Riku, you're really good friends with him, and he's like, I guess you don't need me. I'll play it, like. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I'm just never, ever allowed to hold the controller when we're no. gaming. No. Trying to close off. But I appreciate this hotel, which is just three rooms. Mm -hmm. A four. Oh, miscounted. No, that one's clearly like an employee room. No, the other one was considered employee room. Oh. Do you find it weird that the Mad Hatter has a, a, a costume emporium here, even though he is in another world? I think it's more like he's a caricature logo for them. Does he get, like, ad revenue? <laughs> yes. Surely. Where am I supposed to go? Where? You just back out towards Sid. You go into Sid and then you leave the shop again and then Leon will shop. Oh, of course. <laughs> oh god, I remember. So I thought I'd done something wrong the first time I played this game. It's like, why is no one showing up? Why Why can't I find anyone? Yes, yeah, so someone says Mad Hatter needs to make a living too. I mean, I guess. It's a good job that, like, the currency exchange is just the same money everywhere. In the entire universe, is Connor has insisted that you kick Leon's ass. Oh, I will. Another one that I've never managed to achieve. I don't think I have either. But if I farm enough, I might actually manage it. Can you Google quickly how much the level I need to be to do that? I'm sure it's probably supposed to be impossible at this like point. But I'm currently level seven. Well, yeah, it would be possible at level 7. So I might just farm one more level. Okay. Just because I might as well, right? Yeah, why not? Because it's what, it's what I deserve. It is what you... Uh, Connor says, do you have Dodge Roller Guard yet? Which you do not. No! I don't have, I don't have anything. I, I'm at the beginning of the game. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I do adore my Next Rising hoodie and I do wear it all the time. It's true. Like... I don't just wear it on stream, I literally wear it almost every single day because it's the comfiest hoodie I own. It's true. It's, it's very They're comfy. Very good hoodies. And the person who made the hoodie I'm always wearing, the jumper I'm always wearing, is going to be making it arriving like designs soon. Yeah! And I'm very excited to wear it constantly alongside my next riding hoodie and the, um, and the, um, jumper that she made. It. So Connor says if you have guard you can hit him with the, his own fireballs. Ooh, where do I get guard? I think it's just a level up thing. Mm. Uh, would we ever play Final Fantasy XV on here? It's kind of a long game to... And my god, if you think that the way I'm doing this is like tedious, you would hate watching me play Final Fantasy XV. Because I... My god. I'm amazed that you can stand me playing video games in front of you, my love. It's fine. I like watching you grind. But I love grinding in games. Seems a bit rude saying that, doesn't it? <laughs> like, I love grinding, so I just spend a lot of time in Final Fantasy XV just going around and levelling up. Like, doing all of the mini-quests, doing all of the, like, the, um, 
farming. It's a man, I just, I, I think it would be boring for people to watch. Like, I feel like this is probably boring for people to watch because I'm just running around fighting things, trying to level up. Oh, we're talking. I mean, usually we'd be doing this but not even doing anything else at the same time, so. I haven't opened boxes yet, so I figured that out. Jerry has just reminded you should at least have scanned by now. Make sure to go on and equip your abilities. Ah, thank you, Jerry. <laughs> I, I did forget that that is a thing I should do. Favorite Final Fantasy Fifteen character? Prompto. Prompto? I think I'm going for Prompto. I think I agree. It's Prompto. Okay, I got sliding dash. Noctis is a close second or tie first. But we love us some Prompto in this house. In this house we appreciate and love one Choker Boy. Although Your Cindy... Cindy is like way up there because like, she is ride or die. Like the world's ending? That's okay, I can still make the car good. She's a queen, she just deserved more story and yeah. interaction. That is true of literally all of the of Final Fantasy 15 modes. Everyone deserves more story. Oh, thank you, Stacey. Thank you oh, for coming along. We love you, you too. Mwah. We'll see you soon. We'll catch up on Guild Wars soon, okay? Hello, new peoples. Hello. How many are with us now? Uh, there are, according to the dashboard, 117. Hello, I'm sorry I'm grinding. There'll be someone else I can fight. Um, who was asked, we like Dream Daddy, which means we like Game Grumps, or is there no relation? We do. We like each of those things independently. We don't like Dream Daddy because, because it's Game Grumps, but we do like Game Grumps as well. Uh, we went to see Game Grumps live last year, which... Or was it? It was this year. It was this year. Holy cow, this year has been long. Um, I've been watching Game Grumps for like my, uh, six years, maybe seven. And I've been watching it for the three years that you've introduced it to me. Although I used to watch it sometimes with my uni roommates, not that often. Mm -hmm. Um... But yeah, we like both independently and together because both is good. Both is very good. Um, someone's asked, when do we play Guild Wars? Um, I mean, it was Saturday streams, but we're doing Kingdom Hearts instead just at the moment for a change because we asked for a vote on Twitter and that's what the majority asked for. And because I'm desperate to play it. <laughs> Come on, let me level up. Cowards. Connor has asked what Kingdom Hearts characters you would cosplay if you could. Is the answer yes? Yes. <laughs> I would. Who would be at the top of your list? Axel. Axel. Axel and redoing Riku. Like, I would love to redo Riku. Um, as well as... Like, the thing is, I would cosplay every single organisation character. Just need one coat. I just need one coat because I would love to do Zigbar as well. Um, I'd love to do Syx. Like, oh my god, I would love to do Syx. What a little angry twin. Um, like, even Malusha, I'd love to. Oh, just all of them. I love them all. Larkseen, any of them. Just put the organization on me. <laughs> Who do you do? Um. I'm always torn between Sora and Roxas. I mean, that's good, because they are the same. <laughs> yeah, but like the most different costumes at the same time. Mm -hmm. um, like, I think I actually prefer Roxas as a character overall. Mm -hmm. Just like, visually. Yeah. But Sora, then. Sora! Sora. Like, mm, all of them. Who else would I cosplay? I would like to cosplay... Um, yes. Yes. Um, kind of says for me to do Ventus Best of Both Worlds. Truth. True. I mean, if I had... If I had Ross's wig done, I could pretty much just do Ventus anyway. Um, like someone suggested that quote like, earlier, and like, I would do her as well. And you would do her? I would do her. <laughs> I'd say I'd climb her, but I'm pretty sure I'm taller than her. 
Like, oh, my heart's character has suddenly gone out of my head. I'm like, who else would I have going on? Oh. I'm not going to be able to level up again, am I? Um, have you got your abilities? I have one ability and it's a sliding dash. Okay. Ah! Oh. Ah! That was just health. I mean, health's good. Health's good. I haven't got guard yet. No. I think because you didn't take the shield as your main. And therefore, guard's going to take you a little bit longer. Oh well. I'm strong. I'm strong. Level eight, that should be alright. I'm gonna try and kick his ass now. I think when it comes to Sora or Roxas, it comes down to how badly I want my costume to be from King of Hearts 3 by the time I do it. Because obviously, as of yet, there's no mm -hmm. Roxas costume. If there's gonna be one, there's been no reveal. Um, ooh, that one, please. Thanks, Sid! Nope, that one. Pirate Sora is certainly hot. Nightmare Before Christmas World. Spooky Sora is the best. Spooky Sora is the best. When Major Look did Spooky Sora makeup at Halloween, I was just like, I'm crying. Like, I, again, would love to do um, spooky versions of all the characters. Mm -hmm. like, I'd love to do Spooky Riku, Spooky Axel, Spooky all of them. Kingdom Hearts is another one. It's like, I could toss my nothing else for the rest of my life and I'd never be done. Mm -hmm. This is creepy. Mm -hmm. Ugh, I love oh, his jacket. Oh, his little, like, Renoa wings, mm -hmm. though, it hurts me. Belts. <laughs> On his arms, too, belts. You're so heckin' handsome. With the gay earring too. Oh, sugar. Do it again. Do it again, coward. Oh yeah, sachet away. <laughs> Connor says, Sora never let a strange man touch a key blade in a dark alley. Let's go all the way. Can I do it? Can I do it? Please let me do it. I would like to. Jump to me! Come on. Come on, you can do it, good boy. I'm going to keep waiting till light. You don't have guard yet, do you? No, but you can hit it. Okay, come at me, Goro. People not, are- Not like that, not like that. People are calling for you to kick his ass. I'm trying. <laughs> I say so running away. Come on. Dang! Dang! Oh my god! You did it! Okay, that was easier than I thought it was going to be. D Connor, do not say get off in the hybrid bag. I'm very upset. You be so cute! Look at her. I love her. She's adorable. She's so small! <laughs> yeah. So many of the Final Fantasy girls I'd love to do if they weren't so naked. Riku. Final Fantasy X, 2 Riku, I mean. Here is another Riku, a beautiful Riku, whom we love very much. Very much. I used to love my wig for Riku. It was like a one off find on it on eBay and it was like nice. Oh baby boy deserves better. He deserves better pants. And so these weird galoshes. Squirrel King! Thank you! Oh, thank you! <laughs> thank you so much, Squirrel King! Although it feels weird because it sounds like your name is almost Squirrel King. And I just kicked school their ass. No, Connor, Kingdom Hearts 1 Riku needs a cuddle. He needs a cuddle! 
He needs such a cuddle. He's being manipulated, Connor. Manipulated. Gosh. Gosh. Oh, Aerith, I love you. Oh. Again, another character that as a child I was like, oh, the girl, TM in pink. Ooh. And now I'm older, I'm like, she is an aesthetic cutie. I could make you that dress. I have so much pink fabric in the attic. Wow. Queen's coat that I never mm. made. I've got so much fabric. That wig though. Who would cosplay Donald and who would cosplay Goofy? Well, I'm, wise. The, I'm the short one. <laughs> and it means I get to sing um, We're Up All Night to Get Goofy in Goofy voice, but like, as Goofy. Because <laughs> that makes me really happy. We're Up All Night to Get Goofy, as you can probably imagine, is Daft Punk's We're Up All Night to Get Lucky, but in a Goofy voice. We're Up All Night to Get Goofy. <laughs> oh, she's so cute! I love her! You just saw a tiny Yuffie in Crash School because we watched through the other day. She's very tiny. Look at these adults thinking that I don't, thinking that I need protecting. What for you? <laughs> No, Leon, not for you. Keyblade, not for you. <laughs> his, vo his voice was a very good choice. Mm. Oh, I love her. Soft. Very soft. She's very soft. As someone who doesn't know the game but is familiar with the characters when you meet the organisation. Not till the second game. Yeah. Although technically the in-between game, like one and two as well. Chain of Memories. Chain of Memories. Yeah. That's when you meet But them. not until after this game. This yeah. is the first one and they've got nothing to do with the story. No. In fact, they weren't even a concept in the creator's eyes in the story, so... I am saying... Oh, she's so soft! I can make it up the heck! Would you like it? Would you like it? Yeah. Okay. It's going be another part of your Christmas present. <laughs> I can't I, I keep being so desperate to tell you what your Christmas present is, but I know... Was it because you're not going to get it until the end of January? Okay. <laughs> Which is really stressful, because it means I can't even tell you what it is, like... Maybe I can send you a picture of it on Christmas Day, like, give me a picture of it. Sure thing. I'm so stressed, I just want to tell you. I literally read blog the thing today that was like, oh my god, let me find it. Because it sums it up so much of just, essentially, buy a spouse Christmas present. Me, don't say it, don't do 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 it. Also me, this is what I got you. <laughs> it's such a mood. Oh, they little like Fleur de Lis. I was like, oh, they could have been cactuars. Fleur de Lis triggered. Don't. We rented that first house together because it had full of loose wallpaper and we liked it. <laughs> it was also the nicest house that wasn't like possibly a crack. I was entirely sold on the flood release. Yeah. Looks like a flot. It's almost as if. Shame you don't have anything key shaped. <laughs> oh man, glad I had to have that one dialogue. Ah, oh, thanks Leon, I really didn't think of that. <laughs> So happy I kicked Someone ass. telling me not to tell you. I know. I still don't know what to get from you. Um. I think I said. It's dangerous to go and and take this. Can I go take it? Maybe. What bold mountains are there? Ah! Oh god, please let me look at it properly. Oh, Bald Mountain is the... Fantasia. Yeah. Because it's the classical music mm -hmm. night on Bald Mountain. How are there pictures of other worlds? Well, Traveller's Town is, like, weird, isn't it? It's, like, connecting all the worlds as it is. Six o'clock in the past. Can I leave yet? Let me go! Talk to Neil again?
Yeah, we're ready. I'm ready. Leon, a single heartless. We'll never manage this. <laughs> it's what he deserves. Leon's so sexy. He's too much for me to handle, honestly. Someone said earlier I completely forgot to read it out. We'd look good as Cloud and Leon, like, from the Hearts versions. Again, another one of mine, like, I would love to cosplay them during cosplays. Mm -hmm. Which one? Yep. Especially Red Cape Cloud. Yes! Like Vincent Cape Cloud. Because, like, as well, I would like to cosplay... most of the characters from 8 again, like... Squall, Siva, Quistus, Renoa, Irving, Irvine? Irvine. 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 Wait for my cowboy. Not Zell. Even though that's the one you did when we did, like, casual... But I did sort of get forced into that. Yeah. Because you your what? ex was like, you're doing this one. And I was like, I guess I'm doing that one. <laughs> but yeah, that was... Interesting. Um, but also Laguna. Laguna's been on my cosplay list for years. I love me a soft dad. Where did you go, Leon? You went this way. It's a dead end, my son. Ten actually has the least amount of characters that I would want to cosplay in, out of all the Final Fantasies. Like in ten, that I would cosplay Lulu or Riku, and that's basically it. Yuna was a dream costume for me when I was younger, but she wears so little clothing. Less in ten too, even less, yeah. But like Riku, I loved, and I loved her all of her costumes in ten too. I love these little jabbery night boobs. They're so cool. Worst heartless in this game is definitely the big fat boys. Oh, well, you can only hit them on the back of the head and yeah. it's like, it just takes forever. She's like, come on, fat boys. I thought one guy kept appearing. I, I've asked which Final Fantasy or Kingdom Hearts Club place would people like to see us do first. Everyone, their answer is just yes as well. Everyone's got a different answer. <laughs> yes. Which is pretty much just yes. Because that is my answer for what would I like to cosplay. Yes. Oh, Rox is next, all coming out top. Yay. You know, it took me ages to get into the Apple Road repairing. Really? Like, ages. But I think it's because I had that sort of, instead of going into Kingdom Hearts 2 and being happy that it was a new character and that, I went in with the prejudice of I miss my boy Sora. So it took me ages to actually warm up to Roxas. I had that for about 15 minutes, mm -hmm. and then I fell so deeply in love with Twilight Town that when it was time to say goodbye and move on as Sora, I was just like, I don't want to. I'm not going to finish the really? again. Really? I was the opposite. I love Twilight Town so much. Yeah. It's my favourite place in I Kingdom I love Twilight Town. I just couldn't connect with Roxas for ages. So I just kind of, as soon as I could get rid of, like, as soon as I could get rid of him and become Sora again, I was just like, bye, Felicia! And off I went. And then I played it again when I was older and actually... Although, you know what made me scream? What? When you get to the end of the rock spit and you switch and you're Sora again. And then the title screen comes up. And it's like Kingdom Hearts 2 and you're like, I've been playing for this for at least four hours now. And this is the start of the game. It's very good. Connor, you're going to trigger me. Sora, you're lucky. Looks like my summer vacation is... Ah! <laughs> Farming experience. Oh, actually, I should put on that. I've got my extra experience bangle. Nice. Back in. Again, I'm just farming. I'm sorry, guys. This is how I enjoy games. And the cowards didn't show up! <laughs> 
absolute cowards. Let's progress the story a little bit. Okay. I guess. Yay! I just I kind of want to be level 10 before I get to fight Riku. I really want to kick his ass. I mean, I really want to kick his ass. Yeah, I've seen Riku for ages. I know. You'll be way above level 10. Oh, yes. I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> be my boyfriend. Be my boyfriend! <laughs> I learned scan. Nice and nice, very nice. Nice, nice, very nice. Come, come back, spinny boys. Hmm? Uh, Chrono says hidden team in parts one will go through two rooms to make Heartless respawn in the room we've been through already. Thank you. I love you. Chrono knows all the tricks. Yeah. They were cowards though. Right. Oh, you're back. We need to go back out and come back in. Yeah. You haven't gone through two rooms, have you? Go through two different rooms. Oh, let me just try this. Which Kingdom Hearts cosplay would we make for Taika? Heartless plushy like outfit. <gasps> yeah. Oh my gosh! Yeah. Like the little feasy pajamas. Yeah, but with the little antennae. Oh, imagine! It'd be really cute. Agrabah's an annoying level. So I expected more because it's one of my favourite Disney's. I really like Agrabah. But then, like, it had a lot of the fat boys and they could breathe fire. Oh, true. Annoying enemies. And it just, it wasn't as vast as I thought it was going to be from, like, the appearance of it. Mm. Okay. Oh, well. I'm ready to go now. Um, if you go through to where the vacant room is, yeah. then you'll meet that Donald and that Goofy, and then you'll get on the gummy ship. Gwannies? You know what? That's my least favourite part of the entire game. Oh, really? I loved it. Like, I so got I heard really the, into customising. I heard everybody loved it. I hated the gummy ship. Valid. It's like playing Star Fox, but bad. You see, I like, always got really into playing the mini games of games. For, the, for example, I loved, absolutely loved playing Blitzball in Final Fantasy X. I got so into it, like, my, uh, I got my team really high. I told why I, like, dated that one guy just because he had Final Fantasy X and I didn't. And I just used to go around and play Blitzball. And he was like, hey, do you want to make out? And I was like, no, sir. Don't do that, kids. <laughs> it's not a nice thing to do. Oh, I'm so nostalgic right now. That key! That key! Oh, you have to fight Fifi then. Yeah, boy. Right, whilst you do this. Spinny Feety Man. Well, well, this, is, no, this is just Heartless guys, isn't it? There might be a Spinny Feety Man in a minute. Or is he. Yes. Come here. Feces? Feces! Thought I'm just gonna race the blue while you're doing this boss fight. What? It's my channel now. <laughs> it's now B rising. Well, so it was like, well, B rising. Don't do that, don't spin at me, sir. Welcome to the B show. First buzz. Do I have to like... There was just a question that says, why the Steve cosplayers? What do you mean? Why do I cosplay men called Steve? Because I like them. <laughs> I lo oh my god, card games. Like, I just started playing The Witcher. Um, Chase lent it to us. And essentially, I love the mini card game in that. It's so much fun. And in Fantasy Eight, I loved playing the card game in that too. I got really into collecting and like, grabbing all of those things. I really love. I really love doing side missions in games.
I might be that many people in trying to vote. You don't know. You've not been seeing me in that many people in the same room. Yay! Babe, I did it! Come back! Babe, finish peeing! <laughs> There's plot! Oh no! This room now, and it won't feel too bad. Oh no, I do feel bad now. It's not bad. An obvious eh? Oh, you're so good. It was good, pure Sora. We had no snacks, but I have a kicked his ass. So, uh, go with them. Oh, you've lost all of your friends. And one of them is now ten years old. Do no. It. Selfie. She's fifteen. Oh. What month is MCM next year? MCM is always May, well, London is always May or October. Ooh, I'm like way off the screen there. Why are you looking at him? Oh god, he's just. This has the same bad energy that laughing in Final Fantasy X has. Mm -hmm. Like when he was trying to get to Rina that laughing was like the best person, and he's like, ha 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 ha! Oh god. Bad energy. Do we enjoy our Hogwarts houses? Yes. Yeah. I love being a Hufflepuff. It's a very good house to be in. God, I love Disney villains. Mm -hmm. I love them so much. I would want to do um, like gen swap book. Like they do a doing sexy book is like so mm -hmm. Or from the left one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What a queen. Why are you evil, Malefson? And bored and petty. Okay. Good news, Leon. They're everywhere. <laughs> oh, you Eric. just fucked me up. Oh. I'm gonna buy so much food. My mustache. Very dry. <laughs> yeah, but kind of addictive. You know that in that like it's not satisfying. You have to keep eating. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, Shovel. Hey. He's like, what have you got though? Oh shit. Wait till you see it. Come on. Sora, this is for you. <laughs> I can't do it, Donald, but I know that. Here, here's the power of fire. Here's some fire. Holy stomach. Give him that other thing. You know, a punch. Well, that's where you get dog roll. That looks like him. You just come sit in front of the TV, huh? 
Oh no, it's Alice in Wonderland in the first level, isn't it? Sure is. Like I said, if you want me to check on the planet, anyway. Like, if we're going to Wonderland, make sure you've got enough potions and eating to feed the flowers. I take a. Have good time at work! See you at Capsicorn Lab. Um, okay. I want to go. You already had a treat, way. baby. You've already had a treat. Please jump down. You've already had a treat. But you are a treat taker. <laughs> no, but if you come up here, you can have another venison strip. No. Taika, someone's given us a super chat for you. Now you have to come onto the stream. <laughs> See, poop is for you. Poop is for you. You can not take the bucket on the floor. You're very off the screen. No. Oh, bugger. I was looking at the screen, so I fell off <laughs> immediately. These are the super chat boots that you get. <laughs> Good boy. Ha ha, you're embarrassing me. Want to see your little boy? Here he comes! He's a very good boy. Uh, Tanker is not massively well behaved, but he is very smart. Um, but also he's an idiot a lot of the time too. Um, Roscoe Rose, I think you've just joined us. We've been talking about Fuzzle and Kingdom Hearts for like the last hour of the stream. Specifically, who is Fuzzle and Kingdom Hearts? Oh my god, we've been streaming for like two hours? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Heck. Time flies when you're well, having well. fun. You've arrived sooner than I expected. You knew we were coming? Of course. Are you a heartless? Quite so. It doesn't look like one. <laughs> Just as bad. <laughs> yeah. Oh my name. My name is Merlin. As you can see, I'm a sorcerer, played by Colin Morgan. <laughs> <laughs> I've spent much of my time travelling. I would die for Colin Morgan to avoid his name Merlin. I'd just die for him. The king has requested my help. King, maybe? Yes, indeed. Donald, Goofy, and how might you be, young man? I'm Sora. Ah, so you found the key. Did the ki- Did the king ask you- <laughs> <laughs> What did the king ask you to do? Just a moment. <laughs> I will be voicing Donald in a deep, nasty <laughs> voice from now on. Presto! Hello, Taika! Hi. Oh, hi. You guys can't see this, but um, Taika is sitting directly in front of the TV, staring at us. <laughs> We're his TV now. <laughs> there now. <clears throat> what character of this game do we hate? I don't think I hate any character in Kingdom Hearts. You can't guess me to train you in the art of magic. You can start any time you'd like. Never does it. Never does it. Let me know when you're ready to begin the training. See you when Winnie the Pooh level oh, comes okay. around. And one more time. Pretty. Can't believe they're married. He's like your fairy godmother. Hello, I'm the fairy godmother. <laughs> I take you back. <laughs> Make her friendly and lovely. Hello, I'm the fairy godmother. Assist you through your, throughout your journey. 
New one, it's your voice. Mm. Oh god. I don't know how much help I can be. I don't know how much I can be of any help. Do stop by any time. I won't. <laughs> Not until when you're level comes Then I did um... Hey, look at that mark. It's blue. I wonder what it is. This is a Trinity mark. They appear in many places, only blue ones react in the beginning. Jump on it! Hold hands and jump! It's raining money! Merlin's like, oh dear, that's my stash! <laughs> that's not money! You weren't supposed to find that! That's my magic box! Magic box. Nick's just opening the door for the dog to go out. <laughs> Please stop stealing my sheet. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> show me the book. Show me the book. Show me the book. No. You believe the narrative. I can. Good. You see a strange drawing on the floor and you decide the best course of action is to jump on it. Mood? Yeah. Did you never play hopscotch as a kid? No, because I always thought I'd break my mum's back and felt really guilty. Because I like, don't step on the crack sort of thing. Uh, don't step on the crack or you'll break your mother's back. I was like, I guess I won't then. Marley. Oh, there goes my drug money. No hookers and blow for me tonight, lads. Um, just please ask that we play Undoing King and Hearts at some point again. We'll probably... Well, this stream is going to go up to watch for anyone who didn't catch the beginning of it. And we'll probably do it again next Saturday. Mm -hmm. Like, well, I want to at least get through the first game. Because the thing is, we'll we want to do weekly streams every Saturday when we are available. Mm -hmm. The only reason we will not do streams on a Saturday is if we are away or busy. Or filming, yeah. Or... But uh, apart from that, we are planning on doing streams pretty much every Saturday now. Mm -hmm. It's going to be fun. What day is Christmas? Is it? It's a Tuesday. Nice. Which means I think our Christmas special video will go up on Christmas Eve anyway, because obviously people are busy on Christmas Day. So, But we will obviously, like... Oh no, we might be away. Saturday before Christmas. Maybe? Depends what time of day we visit my family. Mm. Most God! Do we like beating optional or hidden bosses? Yes! Yes. Oh, so fair prop! I love hidden bosses. I'm such a completionist. Um. Yeah, Jess and King went, were we planning on cosplaying King Hearts? Yes, that's very much on the cards, probably by February. Chip with the red nose. Um, or Dale. I think it's actually Dale. I think Chip's black nose, isn't it? Okay, sorry. Do I remember this correctly? Of oh. I think Battle Level. One, which obviously is one I should go to first because it's the small one. Mm -hmm. like, one. Do you remember correctly that that's Asmodee? Awesome. Or is that Tarzan? Yeah, it's Asmodee. Awesome. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, a Nyx Rising Keyblade would be incredible. Oh, it'd be so cool. It'd be so sweet. And oh, yes, yeah. Chip has the black no nose because it looks like a chocolate chip. Oh! Almost. Tech has been threatening to um, <laughs> Not pull the wires right. out all night. He just sort of stands there and looks at us dead in the eye. What if I pull this? <laughs> what <are> you doing? <laughs> do, 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 do. See that the mission's equal has to offer. Oh, hi, Tiger. Oh, you sit in the couple ones now. Give me my grave, will you? <laughs> Boy, good boy. Hello, Molly. Molly, we're flying a gummy ship. 
Molly, having good adventure times. Molly, I love you. Molly, Molly, you haven't heard yet. Molly, we're gonna be cosplaying Le Miz. We're gonna be cosplaying Le Miz. And you're Javert! And you're Javert! Because <laughs> if you don't come and do Javert for us, we're gonna cry. <laughs> we expect to see you just standing at the window. Like, we'll start filming and you'll just be there. Hi, Molly, we miss you. We thought you'd be excited by that. <laughs> Le Miz, right? He is. <laughs> I think the gummy ship levels just never made sense to me either. Why? Because are these other gummy ships meant to be heartless? Yes. How did the heartless get ships? I think it said they are ships. They can be anything they want. I guess. Oh. Ironically hurt myself getting the shield. <laughs> <laughs> We'll see you this month very soon, Molly. For good times. Yes, we knew that, um, that Taika's name means that. Okay. You picked Taika because it means obviously Tiger in Maori from New Zealand, Magic in Finnish, and Honourable or something? Like, some sort of lord in Japanese? It's a very good word in Japanese as well. Ah, I'm just gonna open fire on this world. <laughs> I love you. I love you too. Like, we'll see you so so soon, Molly. It's going around so quickly. I cannot wait. That will be a night we can't stream. Mm -hmm. I remember being so excited when I first got to this world. I was like, oh my god, it's Alice in Wonderland! And then I played it. I don't hate it, it's just kind of frustrating. Oh, it's so frustrating. Like a... What do you want, baby? You're just staring at us. Blah, blah. What is it? Blah, blah. I've never, ever had food once in my life. You can't have popcorn. Papa. Well, you can, but not this sugary popcorn. Papa. No. That was me. Okay. Let's talk to Dawn. How do you get so small? Come on, sorry. You can't just ask people how they're so small. My favourite thing is the talking duck is really confused about a talking door. If Sora hadn't been a coward, you could have shoved the keyblade straight in its mouth when it was yawning. And you could have got through hours and went around like that. Oh, look at these early graphics, it's so cute. To the person saying that they never played Kingdom Hearts and they were a Final Fantasy kid, both is good. Both is good. In fact, both is better. Yeah, why limit yourself? <laughs> Marley says Donald needs to focus on healing rather than throwing shade. Marley, you know my feels on Donald Duck. You know my feels. Mm -mm. Madeline Broxton's first thought was, was we could eat that rabbit, it could feed three to four people. <laughs> I need to move the bed, I think, as a big person. Um, step on it, I think. Oh, please jump. Oh, so I still need to put dog roll, I forgot to do that. Good games, guys. <laughs> Fire. 
I mean, you're better than me. We would not have beat Riku and we would not have beat him. I'm so happy I beat Riku. No. Sneaky little bugger. Those are my dog treats. <laughs> Um, everyone picks in the house, which keyblade would you like to have? My dream keyblade is always Waste Dawn, but I own that. Mine's Oblivion. Always Oblivion. Can I kick this yet? Um, apart from Waste of Dawn, I always... Mm, and the White what? Oathkeeper? Mm. Kingdom Hearts 2 Cloud Keyblade? Yeah. Uh, I, I didn't like a chunky it was. Really? Really hated how chunky it was. Do you remember I had that one a bit? It was metal, so I couldn't use it as a fuzz paper. Mm -hmm. Oh man, I should really give you guys stuff, shouldn't I? <laughs> like... Hi! Hi. Someone's asked what what made us want the kind of dog Tiger is. I'm gonna be brutally honest and just say like we were really obsessed with urine ice at the time. And then I looked into poodles and found out how great they are. And then we met a poodle. And then we met a poodle and I touched it and I found out how soft they were. And then my mind could not be changed. So otherwise it would have been a King Charles Cavalier? Mm-hmm. I mean it still might at some point. What why? Very different question. Mm -hmm. What's your favourite ride at Alton Towers? Wicker Man. Wicker Man. Wicker Man was boss. Best roller coaster there. We went for my birthday this year. Unfortunately, Wicker Man is experiencing technical difficulties. We <laughs> were in that game for three and a half hours. What was the advice to put? Chase knows it like back of his head. Like he will just sit there and it's suddenly just like Unfortunately, um Wicker Man is experiencing technical difficulties. Halloween Town? Because, like, that, to that person I just said they would like to live in Halloween Town because it's their aesthetic. It's my aesthetic because I really enjoy the spooky side of it. But, like, I feel like my SAD would flare so bad. So <laughs> always on dark. Well, the sun does come up there. In the movie. Yes. But it's still kind of like everything's a bit miserable. I, I think I'd like to stay there because I, as long as I knew where the other worlds were. Do you know what I mean? Mm. I didn't get potions. As long as you could travel. Yeah. Yay. And this chaos it like absolute chaos demon. Cheshire Cat is it's the one thing I preferred in the Tim Burton movie. Mm. I really like the blue and grey Cheshire Cat. I still love um, American McGee's Alice. Ooh. Like American McGee's Alice is the one, it's the best, sorry. I was always really happy that it was called the Cheshire Cat as a kid, so I was like, I live in Cheshire! Aww. So it was like, yay! <laughs> oh, heck, the evidence. Just two to say. So we're gonna find four pieces of evidence. I Oh, do you know what ability I really miss that like, mm -hmm. we had right now? Um when the money just sort of swoops at you. Mm. It's very good.
in general. Can you give me items? I know. Ah, evidence. Give me the evidence. Oh, heck. I think it's one thing we got a lot better in the second game was how, even obviously it was still linear, it felt slightly more open worldy. Mm -hmm. Whereas this is just like yeah. such a little maze, we can't really go anywhere. Yeah, no, this game is very much like you have to do this one and then you have to do this one. Mm -hmm. Hi, Tekka. Tekka, why are you looking money, baby? Because I can't get to your foot and I've got a massive foot message. Yes, I'm shaming you on TV. <laughs> Live on the internet, you're being shamed. You know what I missed from two? What? Triangle. Screen ever. I'm not having one. Someone's asked, does that mean everyone from Cheshire can just disappear and bounce in their heads? Yeah, obviously. Like, just sort of standing, you can't. I found I turned around. <gasps> yeah, of course you would. We're eating sweet and salty popcorn. Even though we both recently discovered that we both prefer salted popcorn. And I've been buying sweet and salt for like three years thinking it was Lee's favourite. And I thought it was your favourite because you never buy it again. <laughs> um, so I think this might be the last bag of sweet and salt we buy for a while. Mm -hmm. I really don't like sugar popcorn. Yeah, you kept buying it so I'm like, oh, must be your favourite. If you ever notice that, like when we go to the cinema, I always just Hi, get Jacob. salted. Hi, Jacob. Hi, Babies, go home. Be free. I like that you just saw a sore nut and was like, well, I can't eat that. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> Make me bigger, please. Oh. Make me bigger. See ya. I used to cut school to play this game. Really? Yep. Or it's more. Uh, I mean, not. Don't need to turn it yet, do I? Like the tree? Don't need to. Because that cuts off me getting this way and I need to move this way first. Okay. Hello! From Austria, dang, that's awesome. Hello, anyone that's just joining us, thank you for joining us. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. Anyone that's sort of stuck with us as well, because it's been over two hours now that we've been streaming, which is insane. Uh. So it never feels like we've streamed that long. Something it's like mm -hmm. the longest time, but especially when we're playing a game or something. Mm -hmm. Okay, this one. Hi, Joker. Get out the way, please. Christ. Long live the king. <laughs> Hello. Nice going. Nice, they are. She may be innocent, but what about you? What do you mean? I won't tell. Just your cat is naughty. <laughs> As for the rest of the evidence, you don't actually have to get it. I know. Now you've got two, you can just go back and. I have three. Mm. Right, you can just get three out of some of them really fast. Yeah. It does feel like 10 minutes ago that you beat Riku in the race. Right? Being my boyfriend. Being my boyfriend. Being my boyfriend. If anyone wasn't here earlier, I made Riku, I beat Riku in the race, which means I get to name the raft. The raft. And I named it Being my boyfriend. Being my boyfriend. Hey. And Riku's like, it's just a raft. It's like, no, it's more important than that. Being my boyfriend. Being my boyfriend. I don't remember getting a chance to
double jump, I miss double jump. Which I think, if I remember correctly, like the gummy ship later is called whatever you call the raft. Aha! So like if he wins, it's just called the high wind. But if you win, I think the gummy ship's going to be called Be My Boyfriend. Be My Boyfriend. <laughs> Have you got the hint? I'm not sure what it's called. I think I might just He was just like, I'm looking into the dark, you It's true. And you should have. He wanted you to come over to the dark side, aka, he wanted you to be his boyfriend. So I think he got the hint. True! Oh, Tiger, that's so cute. He's lying on his back. <laughs> Turn the webcam. Turn the webcam. They can see it too. They can see all the like, shanty ass set up. I, don't, I fear I'd never get it back again. True. I'm just wasting potion, but that's fine. So like maybe. There he is. Now it's just Tiger Cam. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Tiger in the wires, I guess. <laughs> Tiger cam. Oh, can I not get through? Oh, heck! Hmm. I have to waste my potions. I turned the I turned the flower on the, the tree and I shouldn't have. Ah. Ah. Crotch um, cam. Oh, heck! I'm so jealous. Oh, saucy. Everyone's mad at me for doing that sound. Have we got any potions yet? Probably not. Oh! You got a shed load. See, the reason this level like, pissed me off so much was because I didn't have enough, and therefore I had to go back to Trevor's town and get more. Mm-hmm. Which well, is like, you can't, yeah. you can't um, fast travel. That's unfortunate. That's just why it's absolute crap. Stench. There's one more that I can get, isn't there? That is in the Mad Hatter's tea room? Like, but I can't get through to it. Okay, so I think the next one. Oh my god, man, it's really cool. Mm. It's enough. Well, as much as move on. True. Who are you? I'm Sora. <laughs> I'm Goofy, and that there is Donald. <laughs> oh, <Goofy. laughs> Pleased to meet you, though I do wish it was under better circumstances. I'm sorry you got mixed up in all this nonsense. The only thing Sora ever says in these little mini cutscenes is just like, I'm Sora, why are you on trial in the first place? I should like to know the very same thing. Apparently I was guilty from the moment I took the stand. The stand? The stand. That's crazy! Yes, bitch, I know that. <laughs> Gosh! Um, who do I talk to, please? Uh, I'd, the like, white rabbit. I'd like to present some evidence, please. Hello. Thank you. Oi. You. Hello. I've, I've got some. Um, cards? Who do I deliver this to? Tyka, please don't knock over the camera, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Tyka, please 
please don't lick my feet. feet. Please don't lick my feet. But now you have venison feet. Well, that's certainly a lot of evidence. I'm still not impressed. <laughs> Cards bring forth my evidence. She's just got a picture, like a photograph of Alice out, and just stuck it in front of like, <laughs> the Evidence scene. A. That's it. I don't know how she did that. Mm, checking all five would only be a waste of time. All right, then choose one. I'll decide who's guilty based on that evidence. <laughs> what? After all the trouble of collecting it? You dare object, you will lose your head. Yeah. I, st <laughs> I simply cannot believe. I cannot abide. I cannot abide by this. I, I simply cannot abide. Which one should I go for? One, two, three, four, or five? Um, four. Are you sure? Yes. Is it with my nose? Yes. I'm sure. It's Alice. <laughs> it is Alice. I have just, like... What in the world was that? I framed the heartless. <laughs> There's your evidence. Alice is innocent. Arr! Silence. I'm the law here. I'm the law. I'm the law. Article 13. Anyone who defies the Queen is guilty. <laughs> you see your double voice. I can't believe this is just Theresa May. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> Seize them at once! Oh my god, that song! Alice! Alice! Who the it's Alice! This <laughs> oh, fight I don't like. like. I love that they put a curtain over Alice for this fight and then they're like, oh, she's gone! And for my next trick, da -da -da. grab them, you fools! Grab them, you fools! Get them, you fools! Grab them, you fools! Get them, you fools! Just for the card, man. Hey, bitch. Did anyone attack you that rose? Yep. <laughs> it was worth it. <laughs> what are you going to do, Queen Bear? Oh, I was instructed. Okay. You ready for a bonk? You're gonna get bonked. <laughs> what do you do you still have to hit the tower? No, I don't think so. to fight the tower. We have to destroy it completely. Woo! Wait. No, let me get my money. I don't care about Alice. She's gone. I like that she's even concerned. Ta da! Alice is a witch. Wunderbar. She must have gotten kidnapped while we were fighting. It's your center of voice. Oh my god, it is. You fools! I'm the one who's behind this, I don't care how! I'd like to stream a game with you where we have to voice everything. Hello. Quit dawdling! Oh, you really don't mind the fact that I showed you Nickus to everyone, huh? A very specific thing. Have you seen Alice? There is no shadows, yes. <laughs> Where did they go? <laughs> this way, that way, does it matter? Left, right, up, down, all mixed up thanks to the shadows. Step deeper into the forest to the deserted garden. You might find shadows in the upside down room. Oh no, big boy! Oh, I hate them so much. That's so frustrating. 
big boy. Big boy. No, you can't bonk me. No! No! Don't slap your belly at me. I hate it. <laughs> Big boys are so annoying to fight. How much longer do I go? I don't know. How much longer do you guys want to go tonight? Yeah, how long do you want us to play tonight? I think we might possibly be able to get to the end of this part of Alice in Wonderland. Oh, sure. So that would be a nice place to leave off and go Hello, Tiger. Hi, baby. You boy. had the longest walk. Why do you look so all night, all of the game? This is what we were saying. Okay, we're going to do a long string. We're just going to play for the next twelve hours. I think at New Year it would be nice to do a like charity live stream. Yeah, that'd be nice. We could do a charity live stream. Where all the money goes to charity. Maybe we do it in Costco. Yeah. So obviously, Lumos was our. Charity of this year. Last year. This last year is year. Papyrus. Oh, yeah, last year. This year is Papyrus. But we haven't really done anything because we thought we had the time that we should make a big thing of it. Yeah. And then we can do it again for next year. Mm -hmm. Oh, this one where you just sit at random chairs and stuff happens. We have to make that happy in the painting. Are we just stuck in there? Probably. Oh, this is like a bit boss fight, isn't it? No maths, I'm afraid. We've what, just to find the shadows? Try downing all the lights! We just threw that light in there. We don't know what it means. Yeah. It doesn't quite make sense in the context of the sentence, but that's fine. Okay. Yeah, people just want to keep going. By the way, the other one and this one, I'm sure, is the Olympus Coliseum. So you unlock tiles and then you finish ours. I know, I think you're right actually. Because I think that's the other thing that got me frustrated was the fact that you can't do the Olympus Coliseum until you've got the Red Trinity. Mm -hmm. And so I flew there first in my first run, and then I had to go back to Travis Town, and then I had to come here, yikes, and then I had to go back yikes, to Travis Town. Yikes, yikes, yikes. Very bad, very bad. Oh, thank you, my boy. Ah. Come back. Like my main thing with like when we go long run streams is that, and especially gaming streams, because I get really into playing, I have to stop just commentary. Is that I just don't want it to get boring for people, you know? Yeah, it's like as long as you guys aren't bored, we're happy to keep going. Because I don't consider myself an interesting person in general, and like I couldn't fathom sitting there and joining a stream with me for two hours, you know. I'd be okay. That's just my choice. Apparently, we're both very entertaining. Some speak, but cool. Oh, fella. Oh god, now I have to fight the big bendy fireman. Oh, Marley's never bored because he gets to see our faces. Marley! I love you. Soon we'll get 
to see our faces in real time. You're right, I probably will, Jashi. Hmm? Jash Cats just keeps being like, hey, hey bitch, do you want to try up here? Hey bitch. The shadows should be here soon. Are you prepared for the worst? If not, too bad. Oh, it's Wiggly Man. Yeah, that's what I said. It's Wiggly Fire Man. I mean, he's an aesthetic look, but... Also, I can never trust a person with that many faces. You freeze, please. Come on, Josh. Favourite Final Fantasy? Uh, seven and nine. Like, I always go back to nine. I think it's completely underrated as a game. I just think it's lovely. Because, like, seven has the epicness that you want from that sort of game. It's huge, it's vast, it feels like it could be a real world. But nine has, like, this just cute aesthetic charm which all the characters are really endearing the world is really endearing I really like it, it's really underrated if you notice the person has just asked why Jack wasn't in the last episode, Chase also wasn't in the last episode sometimes people can't make it and sometimes it's not relevant to the plot to have that character in the episode yeah. And it didn't make sense for Bob to be in that one, so we'd already planned out mm -hmm. things. Anyway, I was going to say, if that's your reason for Life in Nine, I know I keep saying it, but we need to play Nino Cooney, which is the Square Enix, um, not Square Enix, the stu Studio Ghibli RPG. No, I, I really want to play it. You're yeah, on a second though. Because it's the most charming RPG game I've ever played in my life. Speaking of like RPG games, I was reminded of the game Dragon Guard the other day, which I have not played since I was like maybe fourteen. And Christ, it's such a like charming game. Like the character, it's basically as you can guess, Dragon Guards, but it's like all epic fantasy, dragons and magic and awesome stuff. I'm keeping this guy's ass. I've never played Lost Odyssey. Sorry. Oh god, Lost Odyssey! Okay, I got to the bit in Lost Odyssey, I think it was on disc 3, perhaps? Where essentially you have to stop these four dragons from going around the world and destroying places. I couldn't do it. I got frustrated and like turned the game off and I never turned it back on. Oh my god. With my boyfriend. With my boyfriend. Oh, then it's its horn. He's dead now. Maybe it means like horn, like battle horn. Oh, we can hope. If it's dead now. Please don't kill Ifrit. He's a precious summon. I love him. I didn't want to grind. It was so annoying. Yeah, that sounded like something closed. Ah, oh, it spat out this weird little bit of alien tech. This gummy ain't like the others, no sir. Okay, I'll hold on to it. <laughs> Navi G! Navi G! Splendid, you're quite the hero. If you're looking for Alice, she's not here. She's off. Off into the shadows with the darkness. No. No. 
Let's get back to our gummy ship. We might find her in another world. She's dead now. Someone's asked, if you had to make a new ser series for a new fandom, what would you want to do with infinite time and no obligation to continue anything else? Wait, you can make a new thing, or...? Like, if, if we could make anything with infinite time and no obligations to any of our other series, like, what would be the thing? Yeah, so that's Tarzan. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's Flubber's <laughs> Shadow Scout Club. You can use Tarzan if you want to. Yeah, I just want land. Uh... I don't know! Like, we change our ideas so often that it's, like... Mm. I guess maybe a more epic, like, big fantasy thing, or a big, like, sci-fi thing. Well, like, for example, we really wanted to do the Stop. Merlin series, but we just didn't see how we could do it justice to, like, what we'd want it to be, without it being a, like, huge-scale production. So I guess Merlin would be one, mm -hmm. and it would be, like, essentially a continuation of the show, mm -hmm. set in the modern times. Yeah, because we had an idea for that. It was just it was just like when it came down to actually how it would work, it would be like, ah, we don't really have the budget or the scale of production or anything to do what we'd like to do with it. And I'd hate to do it, and then in a few years be like, oh, I wish we'd saved it. Um, like sci-fi things as well. Like mm -hmm. We really had big plans for that Star Trek video, but we didn't think we'd do it justice. And then the fans that we like got were really... Not fans that we got, but the fans of Star Trek that commented on it really left us feeling sour about it. Yeah. Because, oh boy, those hardcore Star Trek fans who are just gatekeepers and really cool, they're loud. That's one of the reasons we didn't do another episode of it. Mm -hmm. is that, we, that is the one episode we got, we've had the worst comments ever. We were essentially bullied out of doing any more. Bullied and some just of the lewdest comments? Yeah, so creepy. And... I mean, we should have somewhat seen it coming with it being gender-bent characters from one of the, like, nerdiest fandoms of all time. Mm -hmm. um, like, I've always had ideas for a huge-scale Resident Evil series, but mm. I, it's not that popular, and it would be, like, too much effort for... Well, there's, there's just no, no, like, pressure to do it. Yeah, I mean, that's what I mean, like... So that would be good. Mm -hmm. And, like, Silent Hill, maybe. Mm -hmm. I've always had that big idea for Silent Hill. Music videos, I think, are one of the things that time and money and, like, production always sort of scares us off. Like, we, we do the ones that we want, that we feel like we can, and, like, obviously we did our biggest one this year, which was the... Detroit um, one. Detroit one. Which, right up until the day we were filming it, we did not think we could pull off. Mm -hmm. And even on the day, we were like, is this coming together? Mm -hmm. So, like, more music videos? Because we've always had music videos that we've had. We've had so many music video ideas, it's like, we can't feasibly do this justice. Like, I'm just going to tell that one of the ones I've had, because I know we're never going to film it, and we're never going to make it, because Taylor Swift and all of her Take rules care. and laws are really awful. Essentially, if you upload anything with Taylor Swift music, she will like. Her, well, it's not her, her music it's her, developers. It's, yeah, it's the music company that own her music. Yeah, will literally just take down your video straight away. Yeah, um, but I always had an idea of doing this big Harlequin music video to um, oh, frick, what was it? One of her songs. Uh, what's the really popular one? I oh, shake it off. Shake it off. Because I always thought that it was just such a Harlequin leaving the Joker sort of mood. Yeah. There's that one, there's like the pirate one that we've had planned for ages. But well, like, that was going to be Black Flag. Like Assassin's Creed Black Flag. Yeah. But it's just like the scale of doing a 18th century pirate music video. And especially just for one video it's like, would it be worth the time, effort and price at the moment? Which the answer is no. no. Because I've found a like 18th century themed bar near my hometown. <laughs> and then, like, Which would be awesome. But the money to rent it wouldn't unfortunately be worth what we could get from it. Yeah. Not to mention the cost of the costumes for something historical, the extras. 
Because that's the thing with that one, with it being Assassin's Creed Black Flag, we need, I wanted all the characters, um, and I wanted extras so that when we had the bar scene in particular, there could be loads of pirates in there. Yeah. Yeah, just I think that's the thing that is the hardest on most of our videos as still at the moment is that we really want we need extras more than anything like mm -hmm. for big productions. But then I think you'll like, notice in like in like Kirkwall Coffee, one of them, it's Carver walking back and forth and like through the streets. But all of the people walking past are just everyone in the in the episode just without their wigs or with different wigs or, or with different, like, different wigs, coats on, just to make it seem like we we know more people. <laughs> who were available on that day. One of the problems as well, though, with extras is the style of production we do, where mostly it's improv. It's it's not like we can grab a bunch of people and say, okay, here's the stage direction, you're doing this. Mm -hmm. Because we have no idea what we're doing up until like, the minute we're doing it. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you, Sarah. I wish you a future of infinite money in times you can do everything you want have, how you want to do it. That would be the dream. Games. Gotta spruce this place up for the game. But I think if I had to make a new series with no obligations to anything else, infant time, it would be something entirely original, like a proper full scale Beyond the Light series. Like, mm -hmm. obviously, we're doing Patient Twenty Seven, which is part of the Beyond the Light universe. But that's which, by the way, episode two is coming. We just need to do pickups um, for like three scenes. But like, what we what we've done with Patient Twenty Seven is like the tiniest little slither. Of that universe. Later. I'm really close the door open. Yeah. yeah. The games. I don't like that Phil's nose looks like a like tomato in this. Yeah, it's too ribbed. Why is his nose so ribbed? Where's your son, Goofy? Where have you left him? Where's Max? There's literally one on Thursday. <laughs> God, Philatetes, you are a. Uh... Did they get. Is this actually Daniel DeVito voicing him in this? Um. It sounds like it could definitely be him. No. No! He's a very good. Robert Constanzo. He is a very, very good impersonator, yeah. Babe. Babe. Mm. It's time for the boy. Wemst. Oh no, maybe not. Oh no, not yet. Not Sad. Yet. I thought it was going to be cloud. It's after you've done the first bit. Sad. Molly! What happened to the Hydra's back? Well, I'm glad I wasted time going there. Uh, there was no point in that, was there? <laughs> Clayton! Ooh! Ah! Clayton! <laughs> Not Clayton! Not Clayton! I find it really peaceful doing this. I don't hate it as much as I used to. 
I think it would be more frustrating if I couldn't just hold down the shoot button. Yeah. I think mostly I just wanted to get through the story when I first played it. So it was just like, having, especially later on when the battles get really epic and stuff. Mm -hmm. It's just like, oh, come on, I want to get to the story. It also felt, I know Kingdom Hearts is quite stylized, but a bit off in the stylization. Because it's so cartoony, mm -hmm. like... Like, at least with the stylization like, in Final Fantasy IX, it's very out there. At least everything's coherent. Yeah. Whereas the gummy ship is completely different to the rest of the game. Mm -hmm. I remember when I found out the slow down button, I was like, <gasps> my world has opened. Yikes. 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 What's in your mouth? It's what? It's yeah. chews, yeah. Okay. I saw him eating and was like, hmm. Do, 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 do. Just killed Clayton, not her. So I said their local con is having the voices of Mickey, Donald, Goofy and Max as guests in January. The month Kingdom Hearts 3 com finally comes out. Max must be confirmed in Kingdom Hearts 3. Yeah. Because it's like, I can't imagine he's there just from a Goofy movie. How long ago was that? Yeah, that was a long, long time ago. Was Who is Max's mum? <laughs> it's Pluto. Don't. Don't. You'll always it's remind like, me of Disneyland. Well, we're in France. <laughs> When we were in France, Nick and I went to Disneyland on our last day. And like, the way that the two people that were in the Goofy and Pluto costumes were interacting was very, um, suspect. It was very BDSM, wasn't it? He had like a collar on Pluto, but then it was quite... <laughs> like... The actors probably had their own little joke going on, and to kids it wouldn't mean anything, but it but was... But to um, us, we were like, we see what you're doing. We see what you're doing, and we hate it. <laughs> Can you imagine goofy sex noises? I don't want to. <laughs> I, don't, I don't want to do that. How do you think about fire, you cat? Come back. Let me kick your ass. I'm gonna kick your ass, cat. Fire. Hmm. Just so smooth. <laughs> Isn't he though? Like, Tarzan is very smooth. He's very smooth. He's just a white man with dreadlocks. As much as I like this film. Uh, yeah. Why did you kill me? Goofy sex noise. He's still not quite. It there. Where's his beard? Gives me a coward for not giving us a hairy man. Right. Huh? How does he shave? How does he shave? Either he's just like hairless on his whole body apart from his head. The gorillas would never show him how to shave. I really enjoy that Tarzan is just getting fake deep on him. Where are your friends? Friends here. In the heart. In the heart. Take 
This conversation is over. <laughs> He just takes him back to the gorillas who maul him viciously. Ooh, dolphin smooth. Donald's such a mood in this. He's just like, eh, I'm just gonna have a bit of a holiday. <laughs> this is nice. I'm so treated by that bamboo forest. Mm -hmm. Did you know that Turk was like supposed to be a female gorilla when you first watched the film? I had no idea until until I was an adult. Turk's just shout out gummy brick. Same. <laughs> Fear poops. <laughs> Connor <laughs> Riku gay saw a gay gay. <laughs> yes, it's true. <laughs> Picks him out. Sure, let's just follow him. I've got no abilities right now, so. We. Ominous. Please don't kill me. I am 12. I am 12, and what is this? I love this mini game though. It's made me so happy. Yeah, this was always my favorite bit of Tarzan Lad. Just speedy slide. I wish there'd been more. Mm -hmm. Especially like I know there is one mini game where you get timed and points mm -hmm. and stuff, but but I just... wish there'd been more of these to do like different areas and stuff. Mm -hmm. It's just so fun. Mia, my love. Oh, is that our Mia? I think that is our Mia. Oh! You okay, baby? Yeah. I'm strained, understandably, right? Well, neither of us slept well very well. Mm -mm. That's right. Hi, Lord Jane. Oh, she's so lovely. I appreciate her complete yellow outfit in the film as well. Mm -hmm. It's a look. What gave it away? The clothes? The hair? Gorilla! Molly, gorilla, gorilla. Look at this, dummy. Never say that to me in that tone of voice again, Goofy. That's a, that's a sex voice. Look at this. <laughs> Unzipped pants. <laughs> oh, oh, oh no, babe, baby, no, 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 no. <laughs> Continue. Is it raining? Potentially. I don't know because it's dark outside, so I can't tell. Something's making a noise, and I have to investigate. I hate that I put Donald in my party, but I always can't find that like he never levels up otherwise, and it gets really frustrating at the end of the game because I've never oh, had him in my party. Storming. Really? Yeah. What it's is like cold? pouring with rain outside. Oh, I love it. Ah, my arms getting bad again. I have tendonitis. 
which if you don't know it's basically tennis elbow but in your bicep Mm. Apparently, Tarzan was raised in the ju jungle by the gorillas. Communicating, communicating with him still isn't easy, but he's learning. She's heard leaning down. So he was speaking gorilla back there. Ah, that's right. You're looking for your friends. He said Riku and Kyrie are here, and one word I couldn't understand. Why don't we try this? We'll show Tarzan some of the slides and see if any of them match that word. Oh, what happened to the slides? I somehow lost them all over the jungle. Somehow, magically. No, they're all around the tent, aren't they? I think so, they're around here. Uh, that's one. <laughs> that's a very good point, Becca Boop. Huh? Clayton is obsessed with getting gorillas for money because they're exotic and rare, but doesn't seem to care about anthropomorphic talking ducks and dogs. This game, but Clayton's just trying to kill Don and Goofy. Oh! Oh, he's having a, like, <laughs> spooky tea party all to himself. <laughs> Hello! Why, oh, Mrs. Potts. Why are you using Mrs. Potts and Chip for your tea party? Are you good? Clayton's the name. I'm a hunter, not a researcher. Just gonna say it like that, huh? Hi, Taika. You just cropped us to us. Thank you. That's awful. Very bad smells. Thank you. <laughs> Being a oh, dog owner is... Though. Simultaneously, the best and worst thing. It is mostly just poop smells. It is mostly poop smells. I'm picking up poop. And poop. Ah! Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Not for you! But, Father, it might be. <laughs> How did I miss the slot? <laughs> Gorilla. Tiger, what are you doing? He's just breathing his really bad breath right on me. Trying. Oh, no, it is, it is now. The stove has been lit. The stove is lit! Lit! Nice. Well, I think I've got all of the things I need. Mia, please no. I hate the chameleon fight. Um, Tanker is eight and a half months old now. Yeah. Do we know how big he's gonna get? No. No. So we read that some poodles can grow to 15 inches tall at the shoulder, mm -hmm. and other poodles can grow to 25 inches tall at the shoulder. And you're not sure what you're going to get until they're big. Between 15 and 30 inches is poodle size. This is Radiant Garden. Mmm. I think. Yeah. Because it's where um, Carrie's from. Mmm. Mmm. Me and you. <laughs> yes. Gorilla! <laughs> Gorilla! Look at that booty. Connor wants to know our favourite Kingdom Hearts game. Two? Two. I really love Kingdom Hearts 2. Yeah. Hmm, there's one more. Where's the other one? It must be elsewhere? Well, it's fine. Mm. I don't know in the camp. No, I think there might be one that's not in the camp. Maybe in the bamboo forest, mm. hmm. <laughs> Dreamed up gay. Well, that's just the Riku and Sora, our partners game. Very good. Taika! Leave it. What's he going for? His treat's not going there. Oh. 
Oh my god, he's got himself entirely tangled under the tripod. You're such a dumb boy. Second smartest dog breed. Um, um Sophia says by the easel. Oh, by the easel, thank you. So you got <laughs> Hello. You still don't long enough for me to pitch. No, you're good. Oh, how did I miss it? Thank you. Oh. Yeah. I think Dream Drop Difference is the one I haven't played. Yeah. Connor's called it Dream Plot Drop. <laughs> Well, the gold rings. We've been in this jungle for some time now, but we have yet to encounter these strains of wolves. I've waited there with the gorillas, but Tars refuses to take this to them. Then take us to the gorillas. Oh my God. Gorillas. I'm not convinced that he couldn't kill me if he so wished with his chin. <laughs> Why are there ghosts? You must be looking for ghosts. I'll go along as an escort. I'm not evil. What makes you think that? This is my moustache. Well, my outrageous English accent. Tyke has discovered his reflection and cares not for it. Tyke is incredibly smart for a dog. And your favourite thing is that we read recently that he thinks he's mentally stronger than us, which is why he doesn't listen to commands a lot of the time. Yeah, if, you're, if a poodle doesn't listen to what you say to it, then apparently it thinks it's mentally stronger than you. So, I really enjoy it every time he's misbehaving, just doing his the tiger voice that we do for him, of just, I'm mentally stronger than you. I'm mentally stronger than you. Um, someone's asked how do we feel about Shion as a character? Indifferent? Yeah, fairly indifferent. Like, I didn't really get to play 365 five days over two properly. I think it's 365 over two. Um, she seemed kind of unnecessary as a character. I get why she was there, because obviously, like, everyone has a nobody and a somebody. Mm -hmm. But, but also... Oh my god, please. 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 Please let me jump off. Please let me jump off. Please, I'm begging <laughs> you. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, just mainly indifferent towards her. She's she's fine. I don't really mind. Again, I think oh she's got a lot of hate. Huh? Oh my god, her Hercules' is voiced by Sean Aston. As in, as in Sam Yeah, yeah, I know who Sean Aston is. Dang, he levelled up, huh? <laughs> Being a hobbit to a, like, buff god. Sam's always a god in my eyes, though, let's be honest. I guess we're going this way. That way! Connor says if you like homosexual tension, Riku feels an orc 13 and then play Dream Drop. Oh, I have to do like all of those things. <laughs> Hello. Gurchak, please listen to me. Three five eight over two years. That was it. I'm enjoying this little feud going on between Marley and Connor. See, I do remember playing the organization mini game and fighting each other. I think that's all I used it for. And then we tried to play it on here on like the um. This disc has got all like. The but it's not on. actually a game, it's, it's like a just game. a cutscene movie yeah. essentially. I got it on the DS when it first came out, and then my ex sold the DS for rent money. Mm. 
So I never got to play it. I was a bit bitter about it after that. Yeah. It happens. One person can ruin a game for you. Mm -hmm. Christ, let me off. Um, have we ever been told you shouldn't cosplay that character because of this stupid reason, or you should change insert inappropriate things as mentioned because stupid reason? Yeah, constantly. When I was younger, I feel like it happens less now. Mm. I think my, the one reason I always got told I couldn't cosplay certain characters, which I find the stupidest, was mainly, oh, you can't cosplay that character because I cosplay that character, or so-and-so cosplays that character, and that's their character. Mm -hmm. Which is the that was a big worst. thing when we first got into cosplay. It was like this person is the cosplayer of that character, and you can't do it. Like, which is ridiculous. Yep. Nine billion people in the world, only this one person can cosplay this character. Just one. Hi, Audrey. Don't worry about being late. I'm gonna go down to live. Connor? Huh? Connor says like he's swinging off Riku's D. Never mind. Like he's swinging off Riku's D. Monetage. D20. I know you meant D20. Because it's 20 inches. <laughs> I made myself laugh. That's all that matters. Oh no! You deserve that. <laughs> Let me on. Thank you. Going up. Hello. So the very first time I played this level, I could never make this jump, and I was like, surely then I, you mustn't be able to do this. And I spent hours of the game just trying to figure out what the fuck to do Same. next. It's just not quite close enough to make the jump easy. Scoop, scoop, shimmy, 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 shimmy. Dilly dally, shilly, shally. Hmm. Connor says, roll for inches. Why the frick did I just strip for? And, um. Oh, thank you, Daniel! Thank you. Hugs back to you. And what were we going to say? I'm going to type it out. It's not appropriate to say on live on stream. Oh, but I can't look the screen properly. Oh my god, yeah. You're right. <laughs> it was supposed to be a romantic moment and you ruined it. Was the number five? Or was it seven? Seven. Oh heck, I don't know where to go. Hmm? Connor says this part of the game doesn't let you drown Donald one out of ten. <laughs> <laughs> I've done roll to seduce, but it's always you guys going roll to seduce God. Can I seduce God and get a clue for the game? And it has worked twice. It has. I would like to point out I always roll to seduce the monster in Call of Cthulhu, and I have won twice. Yes, you have. And that means that Yig is my boyfriend now. Oh, I need to close the treehouse over there. Where are we going? I'm just going down. I forgot I need to close the treehouse. Who's hmm? that? How do I get to the treehouse? Oh. 
Treehouse isn't through the bamboo thicket, is it? Back at the Hippo Lake, yeah. there's vines off to the left hand side. Oh my god, you're back. Back for another ass kicking, huh? Thought you learned your lesson. And it says, why did no one check for a pulse on the leopard? He's too fast. That's what I I never understood why Sabre kept showing up in this world. Like, what was the point? It's just an enemy, I guess. Yeah. No. Go away, time flower. Yes, where do I go to get to there? One of these trees has a vine upwards on it. It's not going to be over there. Where's this one? Weird. Hmm. Ah. No. Oh, no! Mm. Along death. Hey, Taika, what do you want? What do you want? I love his slow close of his mouth every time we speak to him. He's just like... Why would you ask me such things? I ask you about your business, father. Let me proceed, please. Where do I go? Where you do I go? You need to get to vines too. I just can't remember how. I just did, but I don't know how I did it now. Yikes. There we go. Take a please stop tripping on the wires, baby. No, father. I must destroy. I see them. I see the vine. How much do I get there? How much? Oh, this is what I was doing earlier, and I fell down, and I got confused. Uh. Yay! Hi, baby. There is a Mulan level in number two. Yeah. Which is really kick ass. I love that level. Mm -hmm. Maybe we'll play two on here at some point. I would like that. Okay. Because we've already been asked if we'll play three when it comes out. Mm -hmm. There we go. Three hours. I just... Donald's chaotic energy hurts me. As well as the fact they animated underneath Tarzan's little uh, flap there to make it look like he's wearing underwear. Cowards. Give me the jungle day. Kill it? Liar! Liar! Tarzan's still like the drag queen, I was there. 
<laughs> Clayton just straight up thinking people will believe his lies. My, my, my boy. No. Take her. Leave the Christmas tree alone. But Papa, I've never seen one once in my life. It's true, but leave it. Uh, climbing trees or sliding trees? Um... You can get there yet? No, I don't think so. Do, 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 do. I'd have to say the hottest character in Kingdom Hearts is Axel. Huh? Yes! It's true though. In multiple ways. It's true and you should say it. The Axel is so entirely my aesthetic. Mm -hmm. Two finish at half past my life. Yeah. Because I'm feeling the lag in real life of being tired. It would be like we're at a save point now so we can. Um, get back down to the bottom and there's one save point down there. Let's do some more slideies. <laughs> Axel has big t D20 energy. It's true. It's very true and everyone should say it. I'd like to... I won't. I, I, I want to say you have to now? It's really not appropriate. Alright. <laughs> I'm just saying I'd like to, I'd like a roll with that d20. <laughs> Ooh, that I cosplayed Zexion once. It was the only time I've ever cosplayed a character of the right height for me. Uh, hello. 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 Father. What do you mean? Probably another walk, Father. High five. You're like, boy. Where's his treaties? Is this what you want? Sit. <laughs> oh, good boy. I simply cannot abide I by this. I cannot abide, Clayton. How did he get down there so fast? We slid. He slid faster. <laughs> so, like, Chase has got this, just his middle, his middle-aged woman voice, which it gives me absolute joy. And oh, it's so life. funny when he does that voice. Just, I, 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 I simply cannot abide by this. And... It's all I think about. Hello, we've had your venison. Posh boy. <laughs> oh, are you about to hit the final battle? Potentially? Well, the first final battle of this area. Because never every level have like two stages. So you've got fighting Clayton. Is the last one? Yeah. Like, is it oh, million? there's. No, that's the last one. You've still got the tree boss, which is just like a big plant. Yeah. Oh, I love the monkey heartless. They're so cute. Where did Turk go? Uh, to the person who just asked, can we do a video where we show all of Taika's training? Sure, I'll probably do it over on my other channel, because it's more of an other channel video. Yeah, it's more appropriate for the haunt. Um, so let me just drop... For anyone who doesn't know, let me just drop the URL of that in the chat. And I'll also make sure it's in the description below for people watching this after the fact. Oh, Donald's, Donald's dead? What a shock! What an absolute shock. Christ, Donald. 
absolute waste of air. <laughs> it's only, if only someone had healing powers, man, that's absolute right shame. Like, I'd never cosplay Lexi Lexaeus, but I also think that Lexaeus and Zexion are kind of like part heights. <laughs> I love you. Yes, I come up to your groin. Yeah, you're very small. <laughs> love you. I love you too. Yay. No, I'm kidding. I am that small. But sexy on an accident, least. You're, you're not Lexaeus height. No, I'm not Lexaeus height. I wish I was Lexaeus height. I was saying to Nick, it's like, when I was growing up, I had two ideal heights. Both of them for Final Fantasy VIII. I either wanted to be 5 foot 8, which is Squall's height, or 6 foot 1, which is Cypher's height. I am neither of those. In fact, I'm 5'11, so I'm dead in the middle. Which I suppose is fine, but also. Oh my god, I see my sexy on. Oh my god. Wasn't it just you in a shirt lying in a bed? No, that's Rufus Shinra. Was he in your bathroom? No. I do remember the wig though. I do remember you having this costume. So I remember it being one of the costumes I looked at and was like, ooh, nice. When I had my crush on you like eight years ago. Mm -hmm. Oh, babe, you had a crush on me. That's so embarrassing. It is, isn't it? <laughs> Power move. <laughs> Um, no, you two aren't allowed potions. I take one second to try and look up my old Zexion question and suddenly there's loads more conversation. Um, What's happening? Am I the height of Harry Potter? I don't even know what Harry's height is supposed to be. I suppose it's how tall Daniel Radcliffe is. Yeah. Oh, you son of a... Mm. Huh! No, I'm taller than Daniel Radcliffe! Ha <laughs> ha! Daniel Radcliffe is five foot five. Small. Small boy. Look, everyone talking about heights and cosplay and everything. It doesn't like, matter. It, do it literally doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter. I know really, really short people who've pulled off like amazing Sephiroth cosplays. Really tall people who've put, pulled off amazing, like, tiny little girl costumes. I am definitely the wrong height to cosplay Sarah. I don't care. I really like, like Sarah. You literally, you don't have to be the right height for a costume. You of don't have all to be the, the right things, anything. Of all the things that it's like, oh, maybe it's cool if you do this one more accurate or whatever. That's the least of your worries. Like, do not worry about height at all. And we do so many costumes where my character should be taller than yours. And it's just like, but it doesn't and matter. That's the problem. I'm the tallest one of the group. Mm -hmm. But I, I always end up with well, short characters. So I always have to do, like, the Alana legs. Yeah. Yeah, like the Hannibal music video, Genghis Khan. Like, Jack's like four inches shorter than you. And he had heel lifts in, and you still had to squat down so Alana could be, like, four inches shorter than Hannibal. Yeah. It doesn't matter, it's just what you make of it. Yeah, you go, Sergeant Strawberry. 5 4 planning an Iron Ball cosplay. Yes! I just realised I went away from where I wanted to go. Yes! <laughs> exactly. Someone said, as long as you're having fun with it, height doesn't matter for cosplay. As long as you're having fun with it, nothing matters. Literally nothing matters. Just don't be. Don't be a latest. Yeah. Height doesn't matter. Eye colour doesn't matter. Costume, like, doesn't matter really. Wigs don't matter. Just, just do a cosplay. Just do a cosplay and have fun. I'm very lost. Oh Christ. Why are you looking up? Why are you, why are you looking up? I'm just trying to find mine. I keep searching the username and it's like gone. Oh, shame. Wow. What? It just, they've changed how Cosplay Island works and the friend thing has gone. And I can't find my profile anymore. Weird. Did you delete it? Nope.
I thought I'd need to go to Cliff right now because the Cliff is where the fight with Clayton is. Yeah. But I've got I've just been there and there's nothing happened. Oh, I had to kill things. Well then. Both of my old Cosplay Island accounts are gone, and I guess I've lost those cosplay pictures forever. Wow. Dang. Like, literally, I know exactly what the usernames are, they're just gone. That sucks. Yeah, yours are still there. Why? Meet Cosplay Island. Let me die, you cowards. So, looking at my previous save titles, by the way, the person asked how long was this game earlier. I, uh, that is the very last save of the game, roughly. Gate to the Dark, yeah. No, final rest where I'm on now. But that's 18 hours, 40 minutes. Yeah. So this game is approximately 18 hours long. With messing around. Why does Tarzan always join me for this? Get a job. Do we watch Gotham? Well, we tried it. It's fun, but wasn't hugely. I wasn't hugely into it. Um, like I could watch it but most of the time if I don't, if I don't get obsessed with something, I just don't bother. Yeah. And I didn't get obsessed with it. So I think I might need to clear this area out because every time I've cleared an area, the, the monkey has appeared to be like, "Here is a gummy shit piece," because I guess she has them. Huh. Thanks, Kojak. I think after that I'll be able to fight Clayton. <laughs> one on one, me Clayton. Multiple people have said they don't mind watching an 18 hour stream. Maybe not this time, because sleep. But maybe another Saturday we'll start earlier and like do more of it. Well, we're already like three hours in. Yeah. Um, so that potentially should take us into. January, because we we might have to miss two stream days. Yeah. Oh no, Donald's get dead. Oh no. Oh, what how unexpected. Shot. No one expected that. Hey, hey, hey! Don't throw coconuts at me. Hey. I want to cosplay Aqua Marley. I want to. Didn't they actually talk to someone else? Oh, yeah? Someone had said it earlier as well, and I just want to cosplay Aqua. I love, I love her. Everyone should cosplay Aqua. All of us. Aqua convention, let's go. Yeah, there you are. Is that all for everyone? Anyone else? Anyone want to fight? You're all cowards, eh? Molly will cry if we do Aqua. Ooh, I don't want to make Molly cry. No, don't make Molly cry. I don't want to make Molly cry, ever. Right, I'm at a save point. It is half past. Do you want to know, do you want me to finish this level or do you want to just... No, you've got two bosses to get through. That's what we call it. Yeah, no. I think it's time to call it. Obviously, we had to let this catch up because I know that the stream is a little bit behind. Yeah, not too far though. So we can just say our goodbyes now. Yeah. So yeah, guys, thank you so much for joining us for three and a half hours of Kingdom Hearts. This has been really, really fun, and I want to do more Kingdom Hearts because it's one of, if not my favorite game of all time. Um, and like we said earlier, we're in the big Squenix mood at the moment. Yeah, we'd like to get through it, and maybe some of the other ones before we play the third one. So, oh, we love you guys very much. Thank you so much for joining us. It means the world to us to hang out with you guys like this. Honestly, 
It's so fun and chill. Yeah. And um, obviously there'll be a video on Monday and probably Thursday and Friday next week. Mm -hmm. So watch out for those. If you haven't seen anywhere else yet, I am doing Vlogmas on my personal channel, which means I'm uploading a vlog every single day for the month of December. Um, you can check that out in the sidebar on this Resident Industries. It's called The Haunt. Yeah. Um, and until next time, I'm Nyx. I'm B. And we are Nyx Rising Industries. And we love you. Bye. Bye.